God, it's Friday. The new day for real talk. So join Daddy Rude and Lady Cleo on a Friday night, 9 to 12, for real talk. The show where we discuss all that's real and nothing ideal. Only on Styles FM. Good night, everybody out there in Radio Land, and welcome to Real Talk. Talk, the show where we discuss everything real, as you've heard, and nothing ideal. All right, so tonight we have a great show lined up for you. And guess what? I'm so elated. I'm so happy right now that I won't even bother to give him a clap tonight. No matter what he does, no matter what he says, I will not clap him tonight. People, I'm so happy to see my co-host, Daddy Rude, is back. Welcome back, Daddy Rude. <coughs> well, come next week, I can guarantee I'm going to beat you up. <laughs> but this week, people, he's back with us, and I must say... Thanks and kudos, of course, to Shelly and her crew, and of course, to Mr. Smoozik, Mr. Prestige, who held it down two weeks in Daddy Ruby's absence, and of course, Shelly, who did one of the weeks. So, good to have you guys, I've had you guys with us. Thanks so much. All right, yeah, real talkers as well. And of course, Daddy Ruby is here. So... We are going to be hearing from, yeah, me happy. And I can tell, don't it? Me elated. Me never miss him the first week. Me the glad sing gun. That, that is Daddy Rude. I didn't miss Daddy Rude. I missed UL. But I didn't, I wasn't, I wasn't um, happy. Well, sorry. I was happy the first week. Like, oh, God, man. It would have killed me. Saying gun, yeah, man. Now, that, that's good. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But boy, I tell you, if I must confess and keep it real and talk real tonight, me didn't miss him. You never miss me. If he ever said no, did you miss me? <laughs> yeah, I know. I'm embrace myself. I said, I'm not like him, so guess what? Go and talk and talk. <laughs> I'm um, take too I don't want to hear your answer. You take too long for your answer. Thank you. People, you see what I have to deal with? It's back, right? Huel, Daddy Rude is back. I don't know where Huel is, but Daddy Rude is back. Very good to have you back with us. And, of course, we are going to do this like we normally do. To all our listening friends out there in Radio Land, of course, the World Wide Web Land, we want to appreciate the fact that you take time out every single week to be with us, and we appreciate that so very much. And if it's your first time tuning in tonight, hey, all those watching via Facebook, yeah, um, nice to have you on board. And those who are watching otherwise, we want to say two thumbs up to you too, all our avid stylers, and of course, our Real Talk fans. And let me just say shout outs to all those who write here a yard, Port Antonio, Jamaica. Yeah, we want to load you up. All those in Portland, we want to load you up tonight. And we want to thank you for tuning in every single time to the show. All those in St. Mary as well, we're not leaving you guys out at all. Our St. Mary people on a large up. St. Thomas people, large up, large up. St. Anne, everybody, everywhere, all across the United States, Canada, and the UK, we give you the thumbs up, all right? And we love you guys dearly for keeping it locked all the time. All right, so let me give you those in-house matters right now. And we start off with our social media peeps. And we go specifically, of course, for those who do YouTube, you can check out the shows, previous shows, and tonight's show will be posted after on YouTube at Styles FM Radio. Instagram, follow us at Styles FM. On Twitter at Styles FM 961. And for Facebook, go to Facebook. Go to Stars FM 96.1 and check out that fan page. All right? And, of course, we welcome your comments and so on. All righty? And if you are oh, well on the go in the USA, <clears throat> sorry, Canada or the UK, the numbers, of course, are for the USA 
0332-232-2772. And in the UK, it's 033-0010-33322. In Canada, it's 647-957-9637. So you can tune in on the go as well. We're not leaving anybody else. You know that. You know that, right? All right. And of course, if you are in Jamaica, <clears throat> sorry, my throat, and you wish to send us a WhatsApp message, or you wish to call us locally, um, or you wish to send us an SMS, the number is 876-453-1444. That's 876-453-1444. And for all our friends who are overseas and you want to call in, that number is 954-338-7973. That's 954-338-7973. Yippee. <clears throat> and of course, Cassidy, we want to big up the persons on Bro in Brooklyn and in the Bronx. And that dial is 91.3 FM in Brooklyn. 102.9 FM in Bronx. Alrighty. <clears throat> so we do those in house things and we tackle the business and Daddy Road. <laughs> Daddy Road. What's up with you? We are run or left me go. Eh? I make um, you do it. It wasn't uh deliberate. <laughs> it wasn't deliberate. No. It's not like you were talking about. Go on talk you well. It is something that we usually do on an annual basis. Okay, okay. But for some reason, we didn't leave each other, other. this time. <laughs> I left you. Uh, yes. <laughs> we always leave, leave each other and come back to each other. Can yes, you imagine? Yes, mm. but, but as I said in a message to you, I, I didn't really have any problem sharing you. Oh, man. Okay. All right, because... I, 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 I didn't either. You know, I <laughs> me, me did say, you know, you see, if something just good... You have, to go, you have to go back. Exactly right. so. And, and, and in a matter of sense, you lose all. Share. Share. Sharing is scary. Not necessarily. <laughs> Just don't. <laughs> I'm sure Prestige did not mind sharing me, right, Prestige? And vice versa. Uh, I don't think Shelly minds sharing Prestige either. Right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right. And of course, let me say shout outs to our friends. Um, <clears throat> sorry, it's throat, right? Let me just say big ups to Mrs. Jackson tuning in right about now and Father Jacko. I want to shout you up and loud you up tonight. Um, Charmy, Charmy. I haven't heard from Charmy, Charmy in a little bit. So as my mind just flow on them, I'm just jumping, they're jumping out at me. Diane over there in Atlanta, Georgia. And of course, to her daughter, Diana, congratulations for being successful on that exam. I don't remember the name of the exam, but it's one of those, they listen to styles. It's one of those exams that you are now able to write the prescriptions. Oh. Yeah, man, a very challenging and yeah very challenging exam and she did very well she passed that and now she's able to do her thing up the ladder so congratulations of course to diana um <clears throat> for being successful and of course to all our family who share in this moment of excitement and achievement for her all right big ups also to mr benji down there in buff bay portland big up yourself every time mr benji and, of course, to Mr. McPherson, big ups to you. And, of course, Vivian over there in Atlanta, Georgia. And to all my family and close friends in Whitehall, St. Thomas. Friends in New York. Friends in Atlanta, in Connecticut. Lodge up every time. So, Daddy Rood, mm -hmm. um, how have you? You all right? Oh, my look. Mash up. All right. <laughs> Bush up. <laughs> go work and um show from about three weeks now i'm in a trim so then i said why soap your ball spot a show man i said well i saw your thing set you know <laughs> this is only a spot you know now i'm in a trim of everything <laughs> oh yeah. lord let's just get some 
well, normally when you take a vacation, it's a vacation from the workplace, but it don't mean you stop you working. Stop working. True, true, yeah, true. So it does, I just part it and the usual late night things start back already. So kind of fries out, you know, with the long drive and thing. But everything's smooth, man. Everything's smooth. I have a few things on the mind with more of it. You know, reason with the people them about. Mm-hmm. You know, but apart from that, um, among some really lovely people, big up Miss O'Shea Foster on her birthday, you know. So big up yourself and all of them people away. You know, I spend some time with, you know, overseas, you know, take care of the family and everything. Cool. And we were well taken. You know, you know them type of places where you go and after a while you start get a little negative energy. Mm-hmm. Boy, me did well when I put in some negative energy because people ain't too nice. <laughs> You, know, you, you, you had to carry that rule with you? You couldn't just go? You no. all, you all alone just go? I never do it, but I think about it. <laughs> I said, no, man, them are people are too nice. More I'm putting like some little vibes, but they never too, too warm back at them place. <laughs> and I try to figure out what I can do. Tune. So. Yeah, what I can You know when they start calling me for trick me? <laughs> man, I yard. <laughs> well, uh, when they get all entitled, man, I yard. <laughs> you know, you know, you, you know when principal used to say they make um, the bad boy at the school, the head boy, and that then do a mm, trick me. Oh man! I say man, I am, I am, I am, I am. I say me, me I'll buy one, buy, buy one suit. The suit can't fit me, but the pants can't fit me. Mm. The belly part of the pants tight. Uh oh. The way people they feed me, they mm. feed me. But one if a hand slang, great thing I go on. But you know, it, it was a good, 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 good um look, you know, the environment was good, you know. Cool. Big up mommy win some and thing. You know, big up all the other girls them. You know, Tete and you know everything smooth man, our daughter. Everybody, everybody good. Real talk. Smooth. Me not, me not, me not, me not have no complaint, but I was one little thing star, I tell you chose star the Boy, I tell you, the, the, the trans, them and the, mm, them, the, 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 the mm, people. And the, mm. I knew they, they would have, you couldn't have done yeah, a, well around them, you know. I the, knew you weren't going to do well at all. Yeah, the mm, people, them. No five times, star. I don't know me as a man, my belly, and I have no friend. No five times, one comes and rips and rushes some place and told the, <laughs> told the place, look, oh, me say, rips and going there before me, me, me just bill. <laughs> Believe me, the mm, mm. <laughs> Hey, <laughs> me no <know> star. <laughs> It, 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 it of me. I know, right? You know, don't, if don't, nobody does uh, it better, I do. <laughs> don't, don't, don't to all, all Momo get confused one at a time. Oh, man. Right? Momo get confused. Momo say, uh, Momo say, Mommy, is, is that a guy or a girl? <laughs> oh, God. So poor no, child. Karina say, boy, it's a girl. She said, she no, Mommy, it's a guy. Don't you hear the voice? <laughs> <laughs> Face, you know, make up oh, everything God. pretty. Mm, ouch. But when in talk, deep on oh, road. Oh, oh, Jesus. The poor pit nigga that shock in his life. Yeah. Traumatized. Traumatized, for real. I can't sue for that. I hit a food out for them. I tell you, chot. You're in their place. You are in their place. Yeah, Mr. Man, I tell you, chot, star. I was uh, in uh, Manhattan uh, and I saw kissing and I was like perturbed. Two Seriously. girls. Excuse me? Boom. Mm. <laughs> no guessing they look around at me like, oh my God. Why, I man? just had to pass. People were like pointing and talking and looking and like, oh my. They were sh- the persons who live there were like shocked. Imagine me who just visiting there. Okay. Mm. Why, man? I tell us about them. <laughs> them one way. And you know, the, the whole vibes, otherwise, it's good. It's yeah. good. Nothing to complain about, you know? Alrighty. But. You, as I say, you, you're not at work, but you're really at work because the up and down and the, the, the yes or the this or the pick up this, the, that, you know, that's a whole heap of thing. But apart from that, that's good. Yeah, man, everything good, you know. All right. Well, of course, it's now 9 o'clock, 9.30, rather. And we go to our first break, and when we come back, we give you a whole lot more, and we check out the WhatsApp connection, all right? The time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services, and Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio, Stage, and Lighting. Don't go anywhere. (laughs) 
Architects, draftsmen and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high quality white paper printing that is water resistant and never fades unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 893-2266. Oh, 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 yeah. I the reggae ambassador. This is Jati, the Reggae Ambassador. Join me this and every Saturday from 1 p.m. to 5 p.m. Right here in Styles FM 96.1, 96.5, 96.7 for the Tony Lauren Show in style on style. We're gonna eat you off that G spot at 3 o'clock. We've got the collector's edition with Twin Spin. Inside Music Biz with Teddy Ledley. Nuff, nuff, niceness right here in Styles FM. This is every Saturday from 1 p.m. until 5 p.m. You got it? Really rich now for the other side. Planning a party? Club night out? stage show, a gospel concert, or even a business sales event, let Styles FM be a part of your promoting tool. Take advantage of our low price promotion packages with commercials, interviews, giveaways, reviews, and much more. We have special offers when you mix and match and bundle your options. Contact us at 876-286-9216 or 439-5160. Styles FM for the most effective way to exploit your marketing dollar. Are you sick of living an average life and tired of just getting by? Do you want to take your life to the next level? Learn the secrets of the super successful. Listen to Power in a Half Hour with Coach Mark this and every Wednesday night on Styles FM from 9 to 10 p.m. Learn the habits of the super successful and how to make these habits work for you. Learn to turn your dreams and desires into reality. You can win in the game of life. Let Coach Mark show you how every Wednesday night on Styles FM from 9 to 10 p.m. Native Audio Stage and Lighting now offering stage, lighting and trust systems for your small and medium sized events whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party or club setting you name it, we'll bring it to life call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531 Native Audio Stage and Lighting a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Adele Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude Welcome back, guys, to the show. Yep, Daddy Rude is with us tonight. And, of course, I am Lady Cleo. All right. Now, uh, let's shot quickly to the WhatsApp connection. Just to remind our listeners, though, that the WhatsApp does not take calls. All right? We're unable to take calls via the WhatsApp. So it's just text messages only. All righty? Mm-hmm. And... <clears throat> Let's see now. Hey. Sister Nyla, big up yourself every time. Tired, she says, you know. But guess what? She locked in. Mad. She wouldn't be able to listen, but no, she locked in. Yeah, man. Big up yourself, Sister Nyla. Gillette, Mama Gracie. Hi, Gracie. Juanita in Florida. Bunny in Port Morant. And of course, Novita. Cute name. Styles Mama. All right. <laughs> And of course, Andy, not leaving us out one bit. Hi, Lady Clear, good night. Nicey from Eric, Nisi, right? Nisi from Eric Castle. Big ups to you. You will walk one. Twinkle brain, so she locked. Is a, is a female, right? It's on female ish. Twinkle brain? Her <laughs> brain twinkling? Hey, Taria, big up yourself every time, Taria. Thank you, Mama. Thank you. And are you shut up? <laughs> you are rudeness, and I'm prettiness. So don't take the wrong one for yourself, okay? All right. Okay, no problem. <laughs> and of course, big up to Cassidy. Work with, work with what is what, you know. You know. Big up Andy, give thanks, you know. Every time. You know, one of the things people may ask, you know, please. <laughs> And some people got cost me, but one of the most annoying things is for me to receive a WhatsApp call and now call me from foreign. Straight up. Oh, Meg. The call them, I, I cannot grasp what is so nice about talking to someone after wait five seconds to get a response. I can't, I can't get it. What's so nice about 
trying to have a conversation and the person I say, um, you hear me, are repeating what they said. And when I responded like five seconds ago, then them say, oh, okay, in the middle of asking me a question. <laughs> People, persons who call me then, let me talk about me on WhatsApp, stop. You know what now? Mm-hmm. Um, since I've gotten back, I haven't put any data on my phone. So only, only when I'm in a Wi-Fi location that I'm connected to, mm-hmm. I will see the WhatsApp them come in. And would you believe, say, a virgin I call me from when? I'm a WhatsApp the virgin and I say, road boy, listen. I mean, I have no data on my phone. WhatsApp me, if anything. Mm. Right? Suppose I tell you, say, this, this very morning, as I left out of my yard, so, the said smarty call me. What do you mean, as I left out of my yard, so once I drive out, I have no connection. And I say to the person, Mr. Road Boy, I sent you a message last night, and you still can call me via WhatsApp. So you know what I'm? Me end up having a ton in my yard just to facilitate that call. <laughs> so, if you don't call me via WhatsApp, I'm not going to answer. Because it's too much confusion. I say data I use up. WhatsApp, I send my voice note, I'm work with that. But I can't manage that part. And, and, and every time you call somebody via WhatsApp, it actually goes through. True. So you will call the person and you, and you, and you actually, the call will reach for them any, yeah. either. So we have, to, we have to be mindful of those things. That the, that the cheap way there, when I call a speed a speed, because some of my business brethren, they may talk gainfully employed people that do it too. I want to talk to more <laughs> than anybody else. <laughs> right? I don't talk about the teacher, but the teacher, the teacher, the teacher they might hear me too. Jesus, we broke. <laughs> but the teacher, they might hear me too. We broke. Right? Please, the data, and, and this are the problem when I'm having a cast today. I'm going to talk it straight up. People are calling about something important, right? Because I don't think nobody will call me nowadays, call me for labrish. A long time in a labrish, call me in a laba laba anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Confession, <laughs> right? brother. But what I'm saying is that people who are calling me are, are people calling me about business. Now, a lot of persons are putting data on their phone putting credit on their phone to download data and what they're doing on their phone has nothing to do with business. You can't you invest in your business to just have a conversation, but you can invest in a source on social media. And at that are the main thing, I'm telling the truth, people, but upset me with the people and where I call me via WhatsApp. Right? Because a business they can but they can only use data and they all Boy, you know, say me not no credit for my phone because them put everything on data and them scroll down whole day. <laughs> scroll down whole day. Gillette said that's the facts. Right? So, do. Uno no, me is a man, I don't normally vent certain, but you no call me if you no can't call me straight. But I prefer to kiss today, then ring and say, call me back. <laughs> Seriously. Me would I prefer that. <laughs> but stop. Stop it. I don't like it. You can't talk about something else now. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you there for three weeks, my love. <laughs> yeah, what, well, love? I ask our people, and when I say our people, they must understand what I talk about. I ask our people for unite. <coughs> Please, I beg you. You know, when when me in the States and I look on how, you know, the Spanish people and Hispanic people them link up. Mm-hmm. The French people them link up. Them have them own like a community. Right? And me, 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 me kind of separate black people from Jamaican people. Right? Me talk about me Jamaican people. Them. Me not see where in say boy we are unite enough. Mm. Right? We, we not do it. And there's a major community in the states of Jamaican people, a well, population. Mm-hmm. We might even live in a some place like Bronx and you know Miami, um, Fort Lauderdale, them places. Mm-hmm. Whole Jamaican there. But yeah. if if you really look on the connection, it no did it. Sad. It no did it. No people are talk pato over there, so right. I want these people are talk pato over there, so and you know see nobody go to the one and say, oh, I wish where you come from. Mm. Them kick back one away. Is you know? it that they've and, adopted to and, this and the, the, the environment that they're now in? No. No, I mean, I think so. At the Kuro Kuro. Because people live across the road from you, you don't even know them. They don't even say hi to each other. 
that a part of what I go on for true. But is the reason for what I say, you know, we need for, we, we, we need for recognize so, the China them. Oh. You see me? Them now nah link with oh, we. Oh, yes. You now nah see we as black people around them cash register. Right? So, you have to understand something like that the segregation and that the little me against people, even where I have a party and a dance and them are hype on one another. Right? When you check it out, no people now make, make, make more than a certain amount of dollars per hour and it don't make no sense. We, we, listen, when I say to you, know, all right, cup on for my head. <laughs> Coop on for my head. A long time styles of them there and we say your people up a foreign advertise with styles. I don't know nowhere, neither in a in a in in, in a Florida, New York, Connecticut, where we can go trim. Mm-hmm. And a whole heap of barber shop play styles. And not one of them can say, here we know, we go spend one one hundred dollar a month. A five chair in each of give get twenty dollar. Right? For advertise pan styles. Coop on my head. <laughs> I know me no know no way. You think me, patriotic me, I go sit down in our next barber shop? Me not nah do it. Me rather look so. <laughs> me not nah do it. So me left all the way from down and over to come over here so to trim with my people down here so. Really? That I me. Everybody now nah to stay that way, but me I say we need to do better. As not just black people, as Jamaicans. I've been always a cousin. Remember, you know, me always a cousin. I said, boy, we have to stop teaching people to talk Jamaican language because don't know we don't know. No, no, no German man, I still until you have to speak German. Mm-hmm. No French man, I still until you have to speak um, Chinese. No Japanese, not until you have to speak Chinese. Oh, I'm Japanese. Portuguese, all of them, all of them, like sitting there. <laughs> no, for we don't know Spanish. And, and teacher, may I talk to you now? Praise the Lord. You, may I talk to her, I Lord this time. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Take me and no people. Far too long in a, this country we have subjects like French mm-hmm. and Spanish and them are only subjects. Them not teach you how to speak the language. You can't teach a language and try to te- teach people how to speak like, just like English, proper English. We don't talk Spanish. The people never left and know how to talk Spanish. Yes, but the you way, the, need the way it. how it is well on the way how, how it is taught mm-hmm. is not for you. Me using the Spanish, you know. It's taught to pass the exam. Well, I know. It, it is just taught. It is not taught for your left, madam. If you can speak a fluent Efficient, language. Efficiently, okay. It not teach that way there. It, principals, educators, if we now go left, if the kids them can't left school, right? Speak in a fluent second language or third language called Patwa is a language. Big up Miss Lope for your 99th birthday. See? Real talk. It no make no sense with teaching. Because me, they up there, so, and every people around me, I chat Spanish. I mean, I know one sitting where them I talk, say. <laughs> we don't no make no sense. Know, no school. My girl, Agua and Uno does stress is not speaking Spanish. True. Come to ya, man. That doesn't that, that, no, uh. Right? If it's, it, it, it doesn't even scrap from the curriculum if you're not teaching it in them when they're done, they, they, they must be lingual. It's not, it's not supposed mm-hmm. to be. Um, how to speak proper. It's not supposed to be and, a proper and thing. And the subjects and the verbs right? just to pass this. Right. It's not supposed to be that. We're supposed to be bilingual and trilingual and multilingual and all kind of lingu- <laughs> linguistic. <laughs> Zane, because to all the things set now, you know, because I guess they want to know of China people them, I learn Spanish because enough Chinese are coming here. You know, not hear nothing. But them are teach Chinese in a full school. Why not? Yeah, let me, me tell you something. We are going to look like idiot. Can we look like idiot up a foreign? <laughs> right? And only when the youth them go to Cuba, you have to spend one year to learn the language. One year you have to spend a Cuba. All who left from your son go to Cuba. If you're not, because them teach you in Spanish. Them mm. not going to break down nothing to you. You have to write your exam and you in a Spanish. And that me I say. To all the world are run. To all we are, we are talking about exams and becoming um, more kids know of. 21st oh, oh, century kids, etc. Right. You have a, you have a bilingual, right? We are export a whole heap of people. When the teacher them and the nurse them get up and go on a foreign, which one of them are take out themselves and go to Spanish class? Or go host themselves or friend some Spanish people. They never, they never friend them on a Jamaican people. 
And the Spanish them speak. Nice, sweet English. Kill you dead. A English are their first language. But when they link up with them one another round, you see them when they chat Spanish. Oh, look at Marco Ballet, boy. That they must say. <laughs> right? And all we do is kick back and look on one another what we are wear, where we go, True. What we, what, what, how, how we live. What that's, we all we, what, 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 that, that's all we are do. How much are we there foreign and migrate and go say we're going to study some more? How much are we do that? Them there's something that teacher may I tell you straight up. From the from, from the from the pit them there some little school. Because right now, you know. Me I tell my wife from what they say, boy, this thing we are going, we may have to pay so much money per term. If my pit go left and can't chat the language, it don't make no sense. We are being invaded and we are teach people feel with culture and we are teach and we not learn nothing. All we do is put on data on the phone and look, <laughs> look and mix up and can call me via can, WhatsApp. Can can I tell you something? Yeah. I saw a couple of videos the other day since week of Caucasians and I guess aspiring musicians with their guitars and stuff. And they're singing. And would you believe me that this? I had to listen for a while to pick up that one of the songs was actually one of our local dancehall artists' song. If I'm not mistaken, I think it might have been Alkaline. Yeah. And when you hear the person singing and trying to put the Patwa into it, it was just absolutely crazy. They're patterning and mimicking and do, trying so hard to sound like us, have that unique sound like us. True. And the words of the song, me personally don't know the words of the song. And this was somebody who me knew show you. the me, words thoroughly. I'm going to show you energy. How much are we as Jamaican people really take up with money and go buy one, 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 one album? Right? Everybody want to party and keep and dance and keep them one or the promoter card they want to pass. <laughs> right? We, we in our, who we know, culture, link, culture. Mm -hmm. Right? Jamaican people, me telling us straight up, we don't have no respect for nobody else's time. My time is more important than yours. That's why we don't stop a stop sign. Well, when we're there, fine, we tap there. When we come a yard, we not tap. Oh, we no want to join a queue out here, but we, we go up there, we, we have to we join not, the queue. We not join no queue. Mm -hmm. Right? We, 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 we there at the stoplight, we go up on the side, and we go in front of everybody else. Oh, yeah. We there in a bank, we go try to know the bank teller, or we go ask somebody if you can do this for me, and this somebody, and this somebody permit you to do it. No can ask me nothing. Right? But, but so, sad to say, so, too. So, 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 so these are the things, you know. Where we facilitate, like say, boy, it's an area. You, you have to be like that. Not realize, say, boy, yeah, cause we are one of the reasons why the line so takes so long. Yeah. Right? Boy, the line long, no, me can't and wait. And the, the I, person on the other end is facilitating the quote unquote right. bigger heads, too, oftentimes, or the friends. No, no, no. Okay, 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 okay yeah. Cause I'm glad you changed it. To, to, no, 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 to, bigger heads, too, one. No, what I'm Acquaintances. saying. Acquaintances. Right. Those are the words. I don't necessarily say the big man them alone. Contempt Everybody, oh. we 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 not we not want to have no farm of me no know me, me, me know where we are gonna do it with straight up. We're just in discipline. Right. Generally me no know where we are gonna do it with, but we need to start meditating and and and, and why me no know. Me look me, me kind of lose words to me all bex. <laughs> you see me? Because as oh me say, boy. everybody else unite. You see, because I'm enough, me go there and me talk to people. But I realize, I observe uh, how I've we deal with one another. I've Jamaican people are fine, who do not live good. Who do not live in good. Coop on my head. <laughs> Coop on my head. You see, if you need to tell me if you trim me, what trim me do? My girl, these things that you have for cut here, you know why I use them. <laughs> what are those things? <laughs> right? Then, the, 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 listen. Let's let forward that after year. Let's see what. <laughs> see? <laughs> what me as a people is that say, we as Jamaican people, we now live good with one another, up a foreign especially. It's still <laughs> we are yard, but we're gone over there, so we're supposed to be with one another. 
you know, keeper. If me did a farm, would have find a country in my head for you. Right. Because me, you live good. Me, see, come, me, me pass whole heap of barber shop. <laughs> right? Even when, even when you go to some of the Caribbean um, supermarket, them, and in the bakery, them, it's like nobody don't know, nobody. Nobody now say how the man in the evening to them, all they might talk to is just like this money where they go there go see. They now try to create that, 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 that link. <laughs> and all of the Chinese, them, all of the Kohli, them, all of the Caucasian, them, we can chat Spanish because they, the whole of them, they, to me, they're white. <laughs> but they don't see them, themselves as Hispanic. Them link. But we, we see we, we, we all pass and some man have all them Jamaican flag in a, the, in, in a them, um, what you call it, o, o, over the rear view mirror. Mm-hmm. And you know so that's money they are Jamaican. And would you ever say, yo, boss, you are going, everything good? Is it true enough? <laughs> I can't tell you who, who used to live a long beer. Listen to me now, you know. Who used to live a long beer? Really? Yeah. But they actually left long beer and go live a Montego beer, spend most of their life a more beer. Of, of this, of that, sell out to China, gone America, gone live. This, that, you see, come enough. <laughs> me can't tell you, I don't know where they are foreign, can't tell me who one is sitting there. Mm. One of the better. Real talk. One of the better people, do better. And all of the people with business up there, we feel, say, boy, I saw business grow because, you know, all right. Sales of them there. Right, well, you know, can advertise on a business with, with, with people know your people. Oh, they were, were, were one trim. <laughs> <laughs> people, let us see what the text line is saying right now. Taria says, took five years of Spanish, can understand minimal, but can't speak fluently. Let's see who else has a comment on Daddy Rude's venting tonight. Um, Nyla says, true, Daddy Rude. Mm-hmm. Real talk it is, right? Yes, Daddy Road. Uh, yes, Daddy Road. That's true about the Spanish they are teaching. Thank you so much, Shauna. Um, Kevin says, we're more to bring down each other. Real talk, Daddy Road. All right. Thank you, Kevin, for that one. Um, the boy, of course, says, real talk. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Gillette also says it's facts that Daddy Root talking bunny serious thing Daddy Root so there are people out there who are actually sharing the same views because they see it they've experienced it and they know what we're talking about um, <clears throat> let's see who else there is with a comment on that um, where are we alright so there we have it big up to the shutter crew in Hussein Thomas um so Daddy Road has given us a few pieces, a whole heap of pieces. <laughs> and uh, just before we go into our thingy for tonight, I have a question for you because every time I'm not here, you throw your things them on me, you know. So right about now, people, I'm going to be throwing. <laughs> I kind of want to hear his comment on this one. I can't even find him. Find him. Let me, I just found you. All right. So I'm going to throw this one on you, Daddy Road, and I really, really want your honest opinion and worth not like, like when you get mad and cross and miserable and angry. Hmm. Yes, I'm going to hear his view on this one. All right, where is it? Yes, here it is. You've grown and nurtured your child to be the best of your ability, Daddy Road. But there comes a time when you have to let go to pick me. You have to let go more and more. Eventually, you can't hold on for their life forever. As parents, how you prepare for the moment when you have to let go Momo? <laughs> when Momo come and tell you, say, listen to me, Daddy, I found the man of my dreams. And when you look at this big, studded guy, thick, yeah, man, look serious and stern. Poor Momo, look a bit in short. <laughs> <laughs> Why is he laughing? What are you are you are you gonna prepare yourself to know that Momo will be moving out? No longer living under your roof, under your wings. Moving out to be with Gary. To live in with Gary at 19 years old. People know I've seen face. Like he might have grown some more air in a split second from the face. <laughs> hey, hey. Girl, go back to your bed, go dream. 
Gagawa <laughs> <laughs> ko ba kayo mega gym? <laughs> gym about living. <laughs> But she's not going anywhere, right? That's what you're saying? Gagawa gym over. Gagawa <laughs> big old crown and tick, tick gear. You must be mad. That's why I went there with you because I know you so well. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so eh? of course that road is not in for that, but guess what that road? No, you have to let go. No, there comes a time, and you know. All right, listen, I'm a realist. Mm-hmm. So currently, I'm enjoying being being in my opinion the love of her life. Right. Right. So a time will come now when she has to leave. Yes, and the, the girl grows up. So within that, within this time, when I have my first squad. You know, teach her as much as we can teach her. Because I teach her a whole heap of things so far mm. in, terms of, in terms of life. Um, things where, where, you know, the basic things we right. have to do, you know, at her age, at being eight years old. Mm-hmm. Up to, up to a, um, it was, I think it was day before yesterday, you know, I called her and said, my girl, listen to this thing I run now. You said that shows the way I wear go to school. It have to clean every day. Right? I care in a in in in, in a lounge here this time i said listen it's that rag there the rag that after after wet make sure say clean though you wipe off your shoes make sure you wipe off as a matter even sure how for use our hand for have the best way for maneuver our hand for wipe off your shoes mm-hmm. and you know say so every day since that she make it her duty to go home and take up wipe off her shoes polish your shoes call her mommy and show her say boy see i i like doing this every single day since wow. that right so but me explain So it means say uh, when she reach a certain age and dirty gary <laughs> right or come on my face and can take off a boat and left left in the sun. Right? <laughs> she have a gary, your mama never teach you say you fit take up your boat and go clean it off and polish it. Same time. Can about a feel say me or do it? Cause my papa when I like you. <laughs> <laughs> That's Daddy Wood coming on, people. Daddy Wood is back. <laughs> so, I teach our journey, j- journey lessons right now. Right. You know, so when that time comes, you know, she, she will know exactly, you know, how to grow and the things and, and the things and what she have to do. So, you going to when, see a shrink? When, when, when will she, you be seeing a shrink? When she leave, no, when she, when she leaves me, mm-hmm. right, I'm, I'm going to be certain, say, it's at that time when she's ready. And she's ready. Yeah, man. All right. And of course, Cordell uh, from Monique St. Anne says he agrees with you on the comments you made earlier. All Good right. Thanks. So here's the other part to this now. You have a brethren. For years we not come. Mm. We'll grow up and you know go college together and all these things, all high school and all, and all these things. Mm. And probably all working in your field. But your friend now for years who knew when Mo would have been a baby growing up. Now she's a beautiful young lady. Mm. And this friend is expressing to you that he's attracted to the grown-up mm. daughter of yours now. Is who that- is now mature enough. She out school, she achieved her degrees and so on and so forth. She's accomplished. Yeah. She's starting out in the work field. So she's gonna be exposed to all kind of people and life experiences is gonna hit her, left, right, and center. But she has been taught well. And the friend sees in this grown young lady the perfect kind of material that he would look for in a wife. What are you going to tell your friends, say? It's, all right, it's like what, 10 o'clock? <laughs> no, no. <laughs> People, <laughs> that everyone is being hit by this one, left, right, and center. The very thought kills him. Of course, we're going to the break right now. It's 10 o'clock, and the time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services. Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage and Lighting. Me, I'll listen for the off-air, I swear. <laughs>
<laughs> Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 893-2266. Hello! Labor rights? We stand to the East Sunday, September 9, when party leader, the most honorable Andrew Holness, endorses Anne-Marie Vaz, next MP for East Portland. Here are the show, Bobby Montague, Juliet Holness, James Robertson, Chris Tufton, Shaheen Robinson, Juliet Cuthbert, Matthew Samud, and others, endorse Anne-Marie Vaz, next for East Portland, Darren Vaz rolls out the West in their thousands, live streaming on all platforms, endorsing Anne-Marie Vaz, East Portland, September 9th, action! Make your mark! Oh, babes, come closer. <gasps> My God, what is that? <sighs> Unleash the strong bamboo with iron mask. Set the mood with premium Jamaican rum and bring the stamina with strong bamboo Irish moss. Try Irish moss. Must be 18 years and older. Drink responsibly. Good day, driver. You notice that you're parking in a no parking zone. You know, so you can get a ticket for this, sir. Really, officer? But just want to pick up some hardware supplies, you know. Do me a beg you. Give me a blind, you know? So if you need hardware supplies, why you don't go to Ramtula Supercenter and Hardware? Ramtula Supercenter and Hardware, 34 Folly Road, Port Antonio, Portland. We stock a wide range of products at the best prices in town. At Ramtula Hardware, experience the three C's. Comfort, competitive prices, and convenience. Ramtula Supercenter and hardware opens 8 a.m. to midnight seven days per week call 715-5132 email ramtula supercenter at gmail.com remember we have the best prices in town don't miss the adrenaline rush with the musical ingenious digital team Saturdays, right here on Styles FM from 4 to 8 p.m. Remember the uprising artists and new music segment from 5 p.m. to 6 p.m. Also, mix journal hour from 6 to 7 p.m. And the party hour from 7 to 8 p.m. Come, Styles FM. Digital tea. Our brain. Look, huh? Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting, and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party, or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Del Rose Green and also Rail Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Hey guys, welcome back to the show. Yep. All right. And yes, we were asking Daddy Rude what he would do with his friend for many years, old, old, great to an Austrian man. <laughs> yes, told him that now that his daughter is all grown up, he has an interest. What would you say to this friend? Mm hmm. All right. Listen. The, the the key to it is maturity. The um daughter becomes is now mature, so she is now at a stage where she can make certain decisions on her own. Mm. And by the way, she's interested. Right. And if well make it worse she interested. Because hey. there's not much once you see, once once people, not just kids, you know, once people make up their minds, say they're gonna do something. Right? They're gonna do it. But yes. The particular friend, and is it like a determine? You know, I think the question is based on, is basically whether she gonna have my blessing or not, mm -hmm. right? No, the particular friend, if him have a have a have a history of being uh, of negatives, then right, and I've not seen within that time to know where he has. Um, matured mm -hmm. and grown into a better man, then pretty much 
it now got to have my blessing because my pity never born for me no guinea pig. <laughs> right? I right. help him find a different catty. Right? For him practice with she. Uh -huh. <laughs> but no with my pity. <laughs> right? If it's a youth, I mean, no, say boy, from ever since, I've certainly ever sincerity. It doesn't matter the age, is what you say? No, it not going to matter. Okay. Right? If him sperm, them I do walk, I do it, not going to work. Right? Him, him, him have to still at that state of fertility, because mm -hmm. I mean, in, the, in the rubbish boat, you know, I don't mean, want my picnic come up and say, boy, I don't want a youth and this and blah, blah, blah. Right? And, and, and I saw, and I saw my, my kind of view. And, 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 and life is. Right. Life must go on. And people, right. you are within, you know? You are carrying your mommy and your daddy's spirit. You see me? Them whole energy. So, that you, they know, I've got to have some positives about him. Every mother, every father want to know some boy, whoever them, 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 them child take up, you know, is somebody with, with positive vibes and, and, and a look towards, you know, greater things. You know, not, not, not like a logo, logo, logo. It happens, but, right, in terms of our aspiration, everybody aspire to want in the best for them picnic. Real talk. You see me? So, I don't go discriminate and say, boy, I choose a friend and, and, and this, that. But, however, mm -hmm. if me find out, say, right, that kind of attraction I go on from before, she's of age, I have a problem with a part Big there. problem. Right, I <laughs> have a problem with a part there. If my say boy, John Oster, yo, I can't wait till she get big. You know what I mean? I have a serious pedophile problem. Pedophile, yep. With that. You know, him, him does a whole lot of panic, 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 can't say pan airways. <laughs> so, they so can't get my, can't get my, um, my thing from that but apart from that still and the other thing where you must have positive positive thinking and positive ways and you know everything's smooth man everything's smooth real talk real talk well for me as i told you this big old ass staring great old man need to go find his own match and leave jojo and momo <laughs> alone <laughs> <laughs> All right, so that's Daddy Rude. Daddy Rude's take on that one. We do have another one for you, Mr. Rude. Um, you said everything we're going, what do you have, fling for me? Yes, man, I fling it out for <laughs> you without warning. Um, here's the next one. Um, what's your view on friends becoming lovers? Uh, before we go to that part... When you're in a relationship, it is said that your partner should be your best friend. Is your partner your best friend? Should your partner be your best friend? You tell just about anything and talk about just about anything with her. No. You mean no? No. What you have hiding? I don't hide me. Eh? <laughs> what you up to? Listen, my view. What them that. sleeves have up there? Exactly. You're not gonna know. <laughs> <laughs> No, I can't, I can't, no, not me. I don't, I don't think say, the every and anything. Uh-huh. No. Mm -mm. So like what you shouldn't tell her? <laughs> <laughs> no, it's just any, any and everything. You can't tell, tell, tell her, tell your partner any and everything, no matter, no matter how But honesty is the me. best policy. Who says? If you go out there and you cheat, you should tell her. Who says honesty is the best policy? It's a it's a famous saying. I'm gonna tell you something, uh, right? That me, I don't necessarily well, share. Well, I'm, I'm gonna show you your energy. <laughs> I'm gonna show you something. And people, someone might burn me out for this. You know, it's a conversation where I've had it in the last week, right? And I show them say when they check out how the Bible set, mm -hmm. two brethren, would you prefer to be Peter or Judas? Judas sounds all right. Alright. Yes. The name oh, Judas sounds right. Who would you prefer to be Peter or <laughs> one Judas? One betray him and one deny him. Peter betray him yeah. and Judas deny him. That's all. What do you say? Alright. Let me tell you something. Who betrayed him and who denied him? Peter denied him. Peter denied him. Yes. Which one worse? The denial no or the Peter. betrayal? No more Peter. Denial? What do you mean? Denial saying no him? What do you mean? You're the hypocrite. The other one, one with no him and, and something in the back? Listen. 
from up front. Well, you know, it's all my same thing. For at least the man have the dignity to kill himself. <laughs> See? Listen what I said to you. When it comes down to relationship, right? There is a I don't I d I don't see why me if I have full control over my woman life. Likewise, right. she if I have full control, control over, over my life. Right? Mm. I'm an independent being. Somewhere, somehow we we are soulmates. But I'm also still an independent being. And there will come a time where certain things are going on where I just me alone probably have to go through that and, 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 and fight through that myself. But she now have to know nothing about Right? And even if she now know nothing about it, I can't come to the woman link clear and say, boy, clear, you know, say this is going on. Mm. And I clear my want to share with because clear probably have the, the ears at the time. The woman I had must have that the type of vibes right now, neither. <laughs> and maybe also she never know, because you know, probably never want to pressure her with that the problem, problem the neither. You see me? So. And sometimes emotional, uh, emotional involvement makes it hard for you to think rationally on certain issues. Because, yeah, because some, hey, let me tell you something, Cassidy. At the same thing we're in, say, boy, you will have your woman and your woman deal with their way. But your family say cut her off right away. But the them now feel, I feel the way you mm -hmm. feel for your woman. So, maybe a woman now, when, when, when certain things are going for you, she's going to have that kind of, oh, well, um, let's pray about it. You know why you pray about it right now, you know? You want all the pizza for just cut off a boy, yes. <laughs> even I though, have to cuss out this morning. If, if, even though, you know, later, later on, you're going to say, boy, boy, I don't know him, you know? You might <laughs> deny you later on, but sometime at that particular moment, what you need is not necessarily what is provided, you know, by your woman. I don't saw the thing go. So, me not believe in other part there. I'm a friend, yes, but I'm not my best friend. I'm a good friend. Okay. Right? I'm a lover. I'm a good friend, but I'm not my best friend. So you will not be telling everything? You can't. You can't. Some things have to wait till you're dead. You see me? <laughs> and when the problem reach, you're done dead, then can't kill you again. <laughs> That's how you talk, can I tell you? That's how you talk indeed. Well, the other part, um, what's your view on friends becoming lovers? Nothing wrong with that. You mean nothing wrong with that? Nothing can't wrong with that. So it's okay for you and a female friend who want to chill and chit chat now and again and everything. All of a sudden, no. Just getting close and intimate and personal and boop, 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 and bam, bam, bam. And the next thing you know, I'm going to go back to just being casual again on the table. Yeah, man. It's possible. Mm. It's, very, it's, okay. it's, it's, it's very possible. There's nothing wrong with that, in my opinion. It's, it's just, as I say, how... You see, you, see, you see, destiny? Destiny is a thing where no one can predict. Because mm -hmm. it is destined to happen to happen so if you if it no happen that was destined to happen if it happen that was destined, destined to, to happen, happen. <laughs> so nobody feels a boy you can deny destiny real right it is what it is so if you see situation reach once upon a time where in say me and me, me I'm a friend good friend we had never talked about it. We have, I don't know something we've ever spoken about before. Right? Good friend for many years. And it happened. And we have never spoken about it after. Wow. I just saw the thing set. What am I supposed to do? And she supposed to do. Mm. You know? Lament and boy. Can't believe it happened and start mash up the friendship. The friendship is greater than the sex. And at that we, at that we have to know. Mm -hmm. You have to just know how to write off this or uh, the friendship. And we're not going to make this level of intimacy what it happened between me and you. Right? Sometimes you, know, you have people out there you know, who them have sporadic affairs. Affairs, oh, yeah. you know. Mm -hmm. You know, it, hey, let me tell you something. What, what, what's the difference between that and buying a prostitute? Tell me the difference. It's, it's different. Oh. One doesn't sell. 
what's the difference? Apart from say I've got peer feet, it's intercourse. <laughs> you ask a question, I give you an answer. True. <laughs> right? So with 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 that relationship, right? You have some people out oh, there cast the way. At that particular time, them know so them can link that bridge in there or can link that sister in there for a tap up and then get it. Okay then. Right? And you yeah, help your friend. You yeah, help out a friend. So people will see it like that. Hmm. All right. Fair enough. Fair enough. The last part of this, which I think is going to really get you. I want to see your face with this one. Hmm. If you discover that your partner, wifey, and her male friend, a particular special, not even special, like special yeah. male friend, had a one-off intimate encounter. Yes. You know, so them are going good for you. Y'all know him, know him before you. Well, you knew him when you met her, pretty mm. much, yeah. And you never thought that anything was going on because they kept it wrapped like that. You know what I mean? Yeah. But it wasn't any long term nothing. Just a one off encounter, and you happen to learn about it. Would you have a problem with their relationship at the moment? A long time ago, that. All right. Long All right, time. outside of you giving me uh, a way you call, you know, where you call that scenario. Mm -hmm. There, There is a particular um, sister in my mind where I really like her, right? And then through me, you know, school and, you know, college and then sitting there, you know, they about she and one of my friends was intimate mm -hmm. right i mean what's a film bridge and an old dog like me <laughs> <laughs> like we, right we know that like right but we did like her mm -hmm. right and to me it never really matter because me know say that neither even last because i know say i cut him a cut and me did still like her and them after them finish whatever they finish whatever wait happen them still talk you know, them still close. Even to very to the day, them still close. Right? And if within that time, outside of my situation, or the opportunity that presented itself, I don't think I worry about that because at the level I like him, so be it after the girl. You see me? Mm -hmm. So, it's, it, it, it's, a, it's, a, it's a situation where it's a boy. If you know, say, your woman or your partner know themselves and understand themselves, and the individual understand and say, boy, that is over. Because remember, you know, enough woman out there, and woman have not enough man out there, and a virgin. Right? So, I want if the smarty way you know, how will she know? And the smarty way do it before you. Mm. I know everybody will. Yeah, well, that's different. Right? You no, know that no, but she's not a virgin or he's yeah, not a virgin. Yeah, but I know everybody, I know everybody where your partner the day with them are going to left on a bad vibes. Right? So, even if they are still friends, we can't go eat the person, have out the person. Why we have them? We have them because they did it before you. Or we have them because you feel that they are going to do it again. But who would feel badly if it is that the man take up another woman? Well, end up having... Intimate relations mm. with this person. You never even tell me about it. No, but what you need to know about you that? You mean? Part? Oh, you mean? No, you don't need to know. You see, you see why the best friend thing can work? You need to know. So no. You can know how to proceed and. Proceed what? How no. to withdraw. Oh, no, hold on. No, you know no what pun intended. <laughs> you know, you, you know, you, you, you know what, what that brings? That brings whole heap of unease where you wouldn't have. Because now you know, say boy, that the sister in it. All right, for example, you, you, you think moms, moms would have feel comfortable if you know, say boy, me and not the friend they, that go on from way, 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 way back mm -hmm. in the days. Right? I can't go tell moms all of them sitting there. <laughs> right? So, but everything is good and everything is jiggy. Why me go kind of want to disrupt that? Oh. So, me understand myself, my friend understand for herself, right? A, a married woman, me a married man. Mm -hmm. So, 
we know say that 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 the part they now go cross. See me? As me say, destiny. Hmm. All right. And I think pretty much I've heard your views on the topics that we discussed. Hmm. Hmm. No, no, after this one off, after this one off intimacy, you know, they still maintain the friendship. You okay with that? Yeah, then, 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 as I said, I'm a living testimony to that right okay. now. Okay, okay. So, so, so me know said there's no violation. But you can trust, you can vouch for your side, but do you, do you know what he is thinking, what he's planning? You know, I know, but, but, but remember too, you know, Zane, me, me, me come like a boy, me I'll even hypocrite to myself because all me, I go say, boy, I chew me can hold firm. Right? Me I go start look yes and look this. Uh, that means uh, right away, you know, my very woman, me not trust she, you know. Mm. My very woman, me not trust she. And he only thing said, no, Cassidy. Just because you know that Virginia said they're my friend, yeah, yeah, pray them. <laughs> but the one where you don't know, you now pray him. <laughs> right? The one where she and him don't link like that. Even the man where probably that the man there is a co worker. Come remember in a road boy, it's when your woman get up a man in time and him spray up and him sweet up. My gosh. Right? Remember. You only are see her for about five if so much minutes. And when he come back in the evening time, him sour. What can I sour you talk about? <laughs> Wait. Then you know they are work, man. You see me? So all of the nicest and the smell up on them something there and the and the ears where she are wearing and the lipstick where she put on where come home smudged. Right? <laughs> she, she left it on the straw, she left it on the glass, she left it on Yasso and Desso. <laughs> See? And Desso. And Desso. See? <laughs> you, as the man, you know, see what I go on with your woman, except in the early morning when she comes to bumps and put on her clothes. And you, if, if, if you're sitting and mess them, you're going to stress out. You're stressed out. The same sexy girl where you take up as your woman, and the same way them young boys say, oh, and the full full marga boy, they think you can manage this, this a machine. Yeah? Eh? <laughs> no. All right, sir. I hear you. Oh, boy. All right, so. Views of Daddy Road expressed. All right, we're going to go to, to, to tonight's Vox Pop, ladies and gentlemen. And. <laughs> Tonight's Vox Pop reads, Sometimes relationships can be a little too restrictive and limited to the point of boredom. Sometimes relationships can be a little too restrictive and limited to the point of boredom. My God, boredom will kill me. Do you believe that allowing your partner to be entertained by someone else but not sexually hmm. can be healthy for your relationship hmm. apart from intercourse are there any other possible ways someone can actually cheat please explain i would love to hear the views from this one Apart from intercourse, apart from intimacy, apart from the man and the woman engaging in sexual encounter, are there any other possible ways that you can consider uh, that someone is cheating? Tell me some ways that you would say, yes, he cheated on me. Mark you, he didn't have close and intimate relations with a female, but based on what happened, you're saying, yes, he cheated on me. Give me, we want to know some of those ways that you would consider cheating as opposed to not considering them cheating. All right? If you were bored in a relationship, what exactly would you do? So, of course, remember the phone lines are open 8764531444 or um, five, nine. <laughs> International number 9543387973. The phone lines are open as we go through the WhatsApp. Um, and of course, we go through the Vox Pops. You feel free to call us in between. So we go with part one first. 
Do you believe that allowing your partner to be entertained by someone else, but not sexually, can be healthy for your relationship? Um, maybe if the person who you're with really know themselves and understand themselves and know why it is that they're doing this. So they, they want a girl, they go out with them and they, they don't mind you giving them a, getting a lap dance done for him. The, the gentleman doesn't mind the girlfriend paying for him to get a lap dance and all of that. Can, can she handle it? Can every woman handle something like that? Yeah? Can you put a silence and say, okay, yeah, I know, it's, it's his birthday and he wants to feel nice and whatever, and I'm right there, so why not? I can just go ahead. Can every woman do that? Yeah? Do you think that any other way of entertainment, is it okay for your man, your husband, to walk into a nightclub, a go-go club, and feast his eyes on these ladies and watch and be entertained? Is that okay with you? Can you handle that? Or will he have to sneak with his friends and go there and hide while he's at it? Hmm. <laughs> Do you think things like those are healthy for your relationship? And I would say, if it is that the party in question can handle certain things and can handle something like that, and if the partner wants it and you're able to accept it because it's not, you know, um, eating away at you to say, this is not me, this is not me, I can't do this. If it is that you are comfortable with something like that, we would really, really love to know. Do you think it's going to help the relationship to get stronger? Because, you know, Daddy Rude gets every now and again what he wants. <laughs> you know, the, the combo and all these things. Things like that, for example. Right? right? Is it healthy for the relationship? And I think if it is that two people sit down and discuss certain things and have made a decision that I want to go this extra mile for my woman to be happy or I want to go this extra mile, I want to do this thing for my husband to be happy and for us to know that, okay, we discussed that we're not going anywhere. We're not leave you. You're my wife for life, right? So no matter what we're going to stick together like glue to paper. <laughs> Can you handle it? All right, Daddy Road. <laughs> Is it okay for moms to get a nice, whoo, sugar coated, honey dipped, nice, studded black brother? Take him home or go where he is and get a wild side on every now and again. Nothing sexual, you know? No form of penetration. You don't have to worry, brothers. No form of deep, deep, that kind of intimate story, story. The only so not going touch. Right? But not really a touch too tough neither. Just lightly and so on. I mean, isn't that going to be like steaming her up for you later, Shine Ed? <laughs> uh, put it this way. The answer to that is possibly... In terms of steam up for later, possibly, yes, but um, but um, the, what? No, hold on. If it's not, or just steam her up, steam her up. No, <laughs> if it's not sexually oriented, what are the ways of which you mention, such as what? Mm. Because, um, we say it's not for sex, but what other way? Because, all right, remember, you know, it's a really interesting Me question, no, no, for the ways, right? Because. Again, you go back to the type of friendship uh -huh. then we uh -huh. either want with your partner. Or we might not have with your partner, but people will say, boy, well... I'll offer this. You, you, you're supposed to get that mm -hmm. from your partner. You have to understand something. And not everybody who get the job can do the work. <laughs> Real talk. See? So... We all in our relationship are most of us are or have been. But the demand from your partner and all things where your partner would have want to happen mm -hmm. 
you can you can deliver. True. And be sure what whatever people are gonna say, well alright, they will learn and them someday. Some people don't really want to learn either. Alright, well on at ten thirty. All right, guys, it's the time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services, and the sponsors for Real Talk is Native Audio Stage and Lighting Stick. Around, we soon come back. Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 8 Eight nine three two two six six. DIB Block Factory and Hardware Supplies Limited, your home for the widest selection of building materials and hardware supplies in Portland. Shop everything from plumbing to electrical to home decor. Find unbelievable prices on tiles, toilets, basins, faucets, shower enclosures, vanity sets, doors, windows, lumbers, and much more. Get up to 25% off at DIB Hardware the last Friday and Saturday of every month with their mega month in sale. Visit any three locations in Portland, Buff Bay, St. Margaret's Bay, and Port Antonio. Call 993-4415. DIB Hardware, your foundation starts with us. For a full range of modern eye care services, visit Ophthalmic Suites. We offer the latest laser technology in glaucoma care, LASIK vision correction, retinal and cataract surgery using premium implant technology and so much more. From A to Z in eye health and vision care, visit us at 34 Lady Musgrave Road, telephone 6300958 or 7596449. Ophthalmic Suites, Jamaica's eye care technology center. Also located at 14 Miramar Drive, Morant Bay, St. Thomas. 1 Bramonte Avenue, May Penn. 43 Fletcher's Avenue, Linstead. And 65 Main Street, St. Anne's Bay. Holy golly! <laughs> Your Saturdays will never be the same again! 9 a.m. to 1 p.m. on Styles FM. Get of the showdown, social commentary, tune, no, tune. No, 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 no. E Edge, your love with a love song. All happening. Between 9 a.m. and 1 p.m. on the People Station, Styles FM, 96.1, 96.5, 96.7. Only the smooth sailing with Colin Anthony. Shotgun to the plane. For complete auto repairs and services, come to Acon Auto Technology, located at 33 Bombo Crescent, Port Antonio, Jamaica. We offer specialist services in wheel alignment and wheel balancing, brake drum and disc rotary servicing, state-of-the-art ultrasonic cleaning and testing of your fuel injectors. We also stock an assorted range of auto service parts, tires and motorcraft batteries. If we don't have it, we will source it for you. Call us at 876-715-5205. Or email AconAutoTech16 at gmail.com. Acon Auto Technology, beyond the typical auto mechanic shop. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting, and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party, or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Adele Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Yep. So, when you really think about it, clear in terms of um, <laughs> mm -hmm. what is because I mean how you put the situation is is almost like somewhere might not happen. So mm -hmm. I try to figure out a way now for myself because being entertained. Right, is is, is, is get a selfish my youth. 
No. You're just selfish. You no. want to have all the fun and get all your kicks going? No. And she can't have no entertainment. No, hold on. Hold you're on. boring. You dance no. dead, basically. No, hold on. And she hold just want to bring on. back... No, hold on yet, man. No, give me a second, love. She want to bring back some vibration of the thing, man. Remember. Live up the thing. No, hold on. Remember. She not leave know. you, you know? She not no. divorced, you know? Remember. <laughs> we're, we're talking about being entertained by someone else and it's not intercourse. Right. She not if, doing, if, doing if, something, man. No, entertainment is very broad. Yes. And to different people, being on one end of the phone and the person that they, they're aware of and they might play a video game together, mm-hmm. that's entertaining. Mm-hmm. You know, and to some people, just for those boy, them partner, doing something with somebody else, they're uncomfortable. Very. Right? But not realizing that this particular activity is something we probably keep them mm. um, going, you know, not thinking about the stresses and all them, something there, mm. you know. Some people sit down on the phone and a labber, labber, and a labrish. Jesus. Right? And then a labber, labber with you, them a labrish with a co worker. Oh, right? But you don't know the people in my work. Sometimes my wife asks me, Who oh, you said, Mr. My girl? But you don't know them. So it don't make no sense. We really even kind of have that. It no matter right? if me want to know you, and tell me. Uh, no, but, but, but do my FBI work. N- no, but more times she will talk to. I'm gonna know who she talk about. Right? Let me, me know tell, so I can go do my CIA. Me can't tell jobs. the difference the difference between who name, um, say Mary and a Mary. A woman and, will find out, you know. A you woman with name will find right. out. But, 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 but. So please, just being, by telling us. Being entertained, which you must man. I must say, look here. <laughs> you can't work with me, right? No. <laughs> When you look up, when, when you think about <laughs> the person, say for example, not giving you any attention, is a whole different matter. You're bored. What kind of attention could she be giving? How what kind of attention could he be giving if you're so bored? It means you ain't getting none. No, it not. But remember, you know, it 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 says, um, your partner being entertained but not sexually mm. by someone else right flirting mm. is that cheating it's entertaining <laughs> <laughs> so it's entertaining you right? don't believe then that your, your partner can be entertained by anybody else no, I'm not say that. Well, yes, I'm you. not saying that. Me, 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 what me, do you want to be entertained by some other filly? I'm always entertained. Oh, Lord, have mercy. <laughs> you entertain me. Right? You entertain me. Right? More time we are talk about some, some crap, we laugh. I'm entertained. <laughs> right? I'm so, trying to pull on the bum here. No, but, but it's true. <laughs> so, so we have to know whether or not then if somebody would have feel comfortable with the other person being okay. entertained. All right, hold on. Would you be comfortable? Well, I'm going to tell you something. Hmm. I think we talked about this already, you know. You know, you will go to work with one bump on your forehead and smile the bus a bump. Huh. <laughs> right? Uh-huh. Now, if me left and go to my work, I'm, and, and, and people will listen, if you don't want to call in, if you don't want to text or WhatsApp, tell me if something wrong with this. Me left my yard and go to work, I'm going to come home on the bump bus. Should that be a problem? How will bossy? I don't be bossy. Then it is a problem. <laughs> How? Did you find you bossy man with your finger? You no. Know, who bossy bump? No, but hold on. You must be mad man. We no. had it already for true. Right. I'm telling you right. straight up. Right. To, to be chaos. No, but why is chaos? It would be chaos. It would have to be chaos. Why would somebody else need to be bursting your bump? Oh. Who she be? No, but why you never bust a bump before me left? Why you never bust a bump before me left? It has stated later and we will come home about burst it. No, nah, man. You understand? She's not supposed to be bursting any bump. She's just not supposed to. That's not her job. No, what will on. She's out of line. No. Can't be out of line. Saying can't be out of no, line. No, she's out of line, man. No, out man. of line. Bursting a bump in the face is a personal, kind of like a personal thing. How? You lie with your boo-boo and you're there and you're bursting bumps. And you're, in a we culture, a burst bump something and a doctor you go. If a doctor you go, not to say, a <laughs> boss, that's fine. Make doctor bossy. Is that Dr. Yago? Why she reached the place where all of the cuckoo in your face? No, 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 all, no, hold on, hold on, listen. It must be crazy, Zin, yeah, man. You didn't have a conversation. Kiasli. You're not catty, did it, Anna? Say, you and Sandra have a conversation. 
I said, oh, Kiasa, hold on, man. No, man, that bomb is not good. Come and bust the bomb for you. Boom, and bust the bomb. Not wrong man. with that? Yes, man. Something wrong with it, man. Leave <laughs> the bomb alone, sir. <laughs> Left the bomb alone. <laughs> Sandra, Sandra, you can't bust for me bump here, sir. But I'm just none of them want to say. On the text line, right here, I say, big up, a big up feather, soup man out of Trinity, Pope Mad. Maria. Big up yourself, soupy. Yeah. I'm a Rasa man when I talk about this, I always, I always I listen to styles. Uh, I think so. Mm-hmm. Madly. All right, so King says, so what if him have a history of WhatsApp calls? Oh, that was earlier on. All right. So, um, from what Daddy Ruda say, it's like, you don't really believe in a partner no. being entertained. No, no, me never say that. Because, listen. What about she and no, well, on the well, phone well, well, and their... Remember, you know, we have to talk about me too, you know. Because mm. I'm not going to be no hypocrite and a double standard, double standard on the thing. And I, and I it, me, I tell you, say, uh-huh. right, for me, right, the thing them will entertain me is probably something where a lot of persons wouldn't feel comfortable with. Mm-hmm. Right, but at the same time, me now got them around moms, and I engage in a certain level of where I call it in uncomfortable situation where I go make she uncomfortable. I may have to hide my phone, I may have to talk in a code and then something there. Mm. No, moms know me are the type of person where I'm very outspoken, I'm open-minded, mm-hmm. Zane, but. Certain things is beyond line. One, one, one thing I do, I go down a certain suggestive road with people, mm. right? Like men and women are talking, you know. You, you will know when some conversations I get a little bit too one, one way. way. Yeah. Right? So certain things, you don't know, really go down them road eh? unless you're the smarty, they don't involve. So my line of conversation, them have a certain level of limits to it, right? Jovial, run joke, and pretty much I eat that. Mm-hmm. See me? I know everybody would have feel comfortable with that. Now, if the person, if you are dating someone and the person don't have a sense of humor, what are you supposed to do? They're miserable with them, you must be mad. <laughs> right? You have a sense of humor, them always are pouty pouty and complain about the negatives of life. Mm-hmm. Can't be. Nah, man. So, so I want to know if her entertainment, um, her m- means of entertainment could be, is going to be different from yours. Chances are it's different from yours and vice versa, as you said. Now, she might not be, she, she might have no problem with you. You know what people are probably with church brother and church sister? That can be dangerous. Right? All <laughs> people have problem with church brother and church sister. That can so, be dangerous. That's why I'm saying, why I'm saying ent- ent- truly... entertainment broad, you know. Because yeah, when your woman have left every minute and say, boy, in, 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 in Ghana, we sit where they, they keep her evening time name. What? I don't know. Bible coming, study? Coming in a church. What's right? Bible study and prayer meeting? Ah, prayer meeting. Every day, then Ghana prayer meeting with Brother Cass. Nothing is wrong with that. Right? And all right, you can talk about, when, 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 when they come home, listen to you know, people, when they come home, um, he will, Brother Cass, say, everything hey, Brother hey. Cass, say, Oh. Eh? <laughs> me so, ask you so and so and so about you know, tell me so and so and so about brother, brother Kiasse. It better if you do so and so and so and Aye. so. So no, brother Kias becomes a person where them where them have put certain level feed, of confidence, it, yes, right? And feeding into infa- and feeding information it, right? too about Wagwan. No, these she's been in a sense entertained by brother Kias because brother Kias in the laba laba with him. <laughs> But yet still, Brother Kia supposed to have a prayer service. Uh, all right. Oh, your question, God. God, if you question. Then, uh, then uh, God work them at the Prayer huh. service. <laughs> hmm? uh, Tigo say I true that daddy road. Is, is it, okay, my question to you, and you will answer me, and yes, I know my youth. Mm. Is it okay for her to be on a video call? With her friend and they chit chatting. Six pack. No shirt no, on. You know, I forget that six pack and all, all, all them fantasy. No man shirt on. My Just girl, well, man, no, 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 no. What's wrong with that? 99% of we know no six pack. A one pack, no for where I push, right? So no, for them have a six pack well, too. Well, on, well, on. let me share something with you. See? If the man got the phone and have no shirt, mm-hmm. right? 
and she are going to and look well one way. You don't see the boy that the energy they wouldn't have is 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 kind of. Why well, you are eh? reading so much into it? No, well, I know. Away you are. Away, away Why you, put, you are reading no, into it? No, well, I know. Away you are put to it. You know. Are, are no, you no, are put, no, are no, you no. put six pack? You know. Yeah, and I'm saying. What I'm saying to you. You don't have no six pack. You, know. you have one pack. Me not no yeah? pack. So you have your pack and you're passing. She not hiding. No? I'm like, she not And she passing. You're passing by and they're, they're just having a simple, normal conversation. And just not happen to be in a shirt while they talk. And you know, pass, you can start right. feel. Me, well, on, no, me, look no, 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 well, no, let me share something with you, Zane. Look nice. Hey, Cassidy, you said me now, Cassidy, you said me now, you said me go and see. Me have a memory in the same way. Right? So, me now nothing. Figure sure. And enough you to pass at them tick self. Right? Me feel worry about that. If you know, say, your woman have that kind of liking, say, and that bridge, that type of bridge, you, know, where you, you see, it's a vain thing, you know. Right? Not for this thing, where, where, where see, I can't see they get ticked there, when, 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 when they lift weights and I build chess. Right? Let me tell you something. One day, I drive somewhere in Hanover, I never remember where I want you to pass. You can say, I, I, I want a real country yacht. Right? Now, I want no shirt, if I'm like that, barefoot. Right? Tick! In my guy, nobody can see the boy, the youth, well, we call now, formed or whatever it is. Yeah. Toned and. Yeah. Them, the youth, they are real, we call it now, because of the work and the life where them live. Studs. Right? The fake one, they wear for lift weights. Mm. See? Them are doing it for a certain type of image. Right? The youth, they wear play ball and, a, and a do sports and all them, something, they're different, something that. Zane, when all of you used to play ball and them thing there, and everybody had grow up and you had your press up on them something because you had try to keep fit. No, it's a different thing. No for them man where, where lift weights and tick up, them can't run from them can't run 50 meters without short of breath. Mm-hmm. So we have to know really and truly what we're looking at. If 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 your woman, if you if your woman up on video call and a and, and, and a man there with with, 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 with him tick self. A fashion monkey that. <laughs> See me? We're not afraid of no, 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 no guy no like hate, that. Well, no hate, appreciate. We're not, we're not afraid of no guy like that. As a matter of fact, me done. if you know you have a woman and a them something she like and, and you not tick up like that, making galang to them and you're going to find yourself a woman. So why you can't tick up? Eh? Why can't galang tick up? Come on on a fashion monkey. <laughs> What uh, may I wear thickness for? It's not fair to say that. No, nah, man. What may I wear thickness for? Not fair to say me's that. Me's a maga, man. Maga, my born Maga. Well, healthy. In the uh, answer my question, you know, people. You no. know, one, tell me if you're okay with it or you're not okay with it, you know. No, no, what I'm saying to you, if I say I'm not okay with it, it's going to be a big double standard because my level, oh, oh, me, oh, me and some of my sister in them reason, even my bridge in them reason. My, 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 my mom's not reason them way there. I hear you, sir. You see me? Pro- pro- probably, me, 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 me no know still. Me, do, you, do you think it's healthy? Whichever way the entertainment comes, once it's not sexual, do you think it can be healthy? And, for, and by healthy, is it that the person who is being entertained, they will use the, the benefit of the entertainment to enhance the relationship? Do you think in that way then that it is beneficial to the relationship? Is it healthy? It, 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 it can be. Can be? It can be healthy and at the same time. It can too, be detrimental. It can be detrimental. Would it be detrimental based on how far or to what extent the partner goes with it? All right. Sometimes it not have to do with just one person. You know. It have to do with both persons. It's, it's how you perceive what I go on because if, 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 if me and you are deal, right? I mean, no, say something where make me happy. Make you unhappy. Mm-hmm. It can't healthy. Right? Yeah, but there are people who are just really, really selfish because they're not getting what they want. So they do end up doing what they feel like doing. It happens many times. Yeah. So, so that's not healthy. Right? That's not healthy. No, it means uh, boy, w- there's a disconnect between me and you. Mm-hmm. And if, 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 if some people stay up late at night and play a video game, um, guys who watch sports, them women don't necessarily want to watch sports, right? We don't want to watch Generation neither. 
<laughs> right? So what we do? We get two TV. You watch one and me watch one. Mm. Right? And whenever time for me and for your time, come on for me and for your time. But we, 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 we have to find a way or we are going to find ourselves, our way, our, our way, our, our way we meet. See? So it's not a situation where in Seboy, um, from a detrimental and, 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 and how you are going to how you are going to make it even worse by continuing mm -hmm. is how you are going to try to see if this person I see what is what is good for you because remember you know if for argument's sake you have a stressful day at work and your way for relief your stress is to come home and depend on social media the whole time and not give me no attention right to you you know that is healthy and that will probably make all cause you feel cook, cook all the pot better because you drain off the stress. <laughs> you know, probably, probably for you, you know, if you come home and talk to me about work, you're going to even miserable and probably you're, you are going to make me miserable. And you mm -hmm. say, but you know, say, I don't want to stress out you well with my, with, with, with my work problem. So, at the same time, it agree me if you see upon the phone because I kill me dead. <laughs> I don't know what Cassidy I talk to. <laughs> I text up right? daylight too. Yeah. WhatsApp I call. Smile. Right? In tick up. Hmm. Or what, what, what can I say they are call you for? Worst right? Was a night. You know, we reach one of my brethren. Good brethren. Although I don't like how you move still, but, you know, I'm a good brethren. I'm saying I like how you move, I mean, in terms of what I might do. I have him wife, real wife. Zane. And for years now, I have an ex woman and thing and Ray. No, a big man for me. Mm -hmm. The sister is even younger than me. Him there foreign, she there yard, so he fly down more time, come and enjoy himself. You know, I reach him now. Mm -hmm. Middle age crisis. Okay. He starts stress out the young as man starts stay up late at night. Hmm. A prayer being online. A who you yeah, talk to. Hmm. And you know more time you can wake up in the night and say I go use all the bathroom and you see the little bright light on your phone, and you check your phone. <laughs> and you know say you got you got your bed same time, you know. But when the person wake up a man oh, and yes. this is a boy, 3.30, the last time you did online. Uh -huh. In that person's mind, you were being entertained. By a man. It has to be a man. The questions are going to come in now. Who that you talk to? This always are the man. Eh? Right? What's so going to talk about? Mm -hmm. This, that one heap of questioning. So, we have to... Try to figure out now how we are going to start to have trust. I do even talk to like all you exactly. all the, 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 the word there, you know, tell you the truth. Oh. I don't think I don't like using them the word. How you have trust in our relationship for balance of your meds. Because them something that we're mad, yo. <laughs> right? <laughs> I know one of the weakest part now, Cassidy, with the madness. When you take up all your phone like my brethren, and I go and bad at the man and I cuss all the woman I'm this that and I go on the most way. She's disgusted. Mm -hmm. And she she she's she, she, drawn she, closer she, to the other person. She, no, she had the one on the side, you know. Okay. And she's disgusted by the behavior. What it left you as a man now, Cassidy. Mm -hmm. It left you end up being lonely you know, because guess I know. You can't go to your wife with your problem with your sweetheart again. <laughs> dog, me am the dog when you have your supper. <laughs> right? Real talk. You, you, you mash up. Hmm. You mash up because the person now who you used to go to for entertain you mm -hmm. has now become a part of your problem. <laughs> And so. you can't go to your wife, go tell her, say, boy, you're being heartbroken. Because mm -hmm. I know she broke, she your, broke heart. your heart. So who you go to? 
So you have to know all this. This, this this entertaining thing that's I'm saying it's a very broad I have a caller under four five three. Hello caller, good night. Hello Not hearing at all. Good night, caller, you're on air. Hello I know everybody are gonna like me. <laughs> but no, I'm a hire. Yes, bright eye. Good night. Do it for the love, me do it for the life. Style FM radio, the station of my life. Yes. Me listen to in a day, I'm a listen to in a night. Night, man. Hi. <laughs> what you say? We day here. How you doing? Well, me day here now. Like when you know, I touch on my text and when I say, me, I wonder how, how me do you. Know? Me read your text a long time, bright eye. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I want to ask you something. Oi. You. Where are you, Dad? I'm there, my brother. I go on easy, you know? Yeah? I'm there, I go on easy. Yeah, man. What do you mean, man? Love that, you know? Respect, brother. I, I want to ask you something, Bright Eye. Yeah. Are you okay with your lady being entertained? By another no, no. male? We have got further. No, we have got no further. <laughs> we have got no further. Why? Me and I better sleep one more, you know. Mm hmm. She put her phone on vibrate and put it on the pillar. Mm hmm. I think it's a gang and watch, but if you got her phone. So the, the phone and a fear pillar, you know, I mean, if I'm my pillar, so I hear this. You know the phone about vibrate? Yeah, uh, mm, song, a funny mm, song, yes. Yeah, man, mm, yes. Mm, you know? See, see our phone now, so you know, the answer is, like, say, it's a woman's voice. Mm hmm. And it's a man, you know? About <laughs> the phone. <laughs> yes, my dad. <laughs> but me, who are the man who most of the talking for me, know what I didn't pick up, say, I know she. Yes. <laughs> So me I try every time I can talk like she, but no. you know the last one the man pick up. Mm -hmm. So the man first the man say, you get locked down last night. Mm -hmm. The man said to her, he said, I mean you know, I'm saying you know, like a she, you know. Yeah. And the man say, you get locked down last night. <laughs> Put me the point there and say, mm -hmm. you know. I'm going to tell you, a woman. Yeah. So, come and say, uh-uh. Eh -eh. So, the man say, you know, get me text. <laughs> so, me, I'm going to say something to the man, you understand? Yes. The man, 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 the so, I carry the phone to her. Which is right. I carry the phone to her until I say the phone did a ring. Uh-huh. But it did vibrate. So you call about the person. Uh-huh. So she take the phone now and she look at it. And when she look at it now, she say, tell me camera that we see her now, you know. A uh -huh. It's camera that we see, you know. <laughs> <laughs> Boy. Uh, I say, uh, I said, that was that. You say, I'm a co worker. You understand? Uh -huh. Yeah, co worker. So, I never want to know. You know, I said, I answer the phone. Yes. So, so bright eye. Oh gosh, we lost Bright Eye right there. Get some credit and call us back. But I know, what about the woman phone? You know what? <laughs> and that, do you get calls on this phone while you're answering the phone? <laughs> eh? It's 11, well, it's about 30 seconds before 11 o'clock. The time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services. And Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage and Lighting. Stick around, we'll be back after the break. 
Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 8 893-2266 Clifford Guest House Sponsor of Metamorphosis on Monday nights from 9 p.m. to 12 midnight with Dr. Iman Black. Located at 15 Queen Street, Port Antonio, that's Ditchfield Hill, they offer accommodations for up to one month. Call them at 285-0610 for more information. Do you have or are you seeking a place to rent? Seeking employment or have a job vacancy? Are you selling a car or having a garage sale? Then come see us. Let Styles do the advertising for you and you'll be on your way in no time. Contact us at 876-286-9216 or 439-5160. Advertising Style. Advertise with Styles. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting, and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party, or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Adele Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. So we're gonna go straight into one of the, one of the Vox Pops, and um, then we're gonna be talking to you after that. Be clear. Regarding that question of whether or not having someone else aside from me entertain my partner, uh, my husband, that's a big no-no. I oftentimes tell women, you're never in a marriage or in any relationship that you're serious about, entertain another individual unless you are practicing some alternative um, relationship, like poly, poly, what do you call it? Well, you, anyway, um, for me, if I'm bored in a relationship, that is something that he and I should discuss. And when I say discuss, I mean, why am I bored? What about the relationship that makes it boring? A relationship is like a car. And I always use this as analogy. With a car, you wash it, you clean it, you fix it up, you, you change the oil. Everybody has a different love language. Everybody. And just like any uh, motor vehicle or any equipment that you have, it has to be maintained. It has to be clean. So it's a relationship. You cannot sit in a relationship and believe, oh, well, she loved me and I love her, so that's it. Or he's my husband, uh, she's my wife, so that's it. Um, we're good. Oh, you have to continue to nurture. It's just like any plant, any flower. If I plant a tree and I don't water it and there's no rain, it's going to dry and wither. If it's a drought, it's going to dry up and it's going to die. So it's a relationship. So I don't need someone else to water my garden. I have a gardener for that. And that gardener is my husband. Now, if I'm bored in my marriage, then I'm supposed to discuss that with him. I, if I feel like he's not listening to me and I want an outside, then it must be a therapist. You know what I mean? And a therapist can come in various forms. It may be a friend who is successful in her marriage, who um, has a marriage for over 20 years, and my marriage may be young, and I want to know, okay, what are some of the things? Or just do research. I don't have to talk to nobody. Do research in various ways, and then talk to my, my husband. But not only that, before you even get into a marriage, you need to know what that person's likes and dislikes are, how far that person is willing to go, what that person is willing to try in regarding, and I believe you, we're talking about sex, in regarding sex. I have, have done things that 
my I know my husband like and vice versa. I don't have to share that with anybody, but that is how you want your relationship to grow. Is by invest it's an investment. It's not something that you just let oh we got the certificate and we have the ring and that's it. No. But there are times when we have different perspectives and we're going to clash. And that's where we have to figure out the best solution to talk to each other where one person can talk and the other person listen and vice versa. But it, a third person, hell no. I don't get emotional. Most women cheat differently than men. A man can go and have sex and he may not be emotionally attached to that person just to fulfill his need a woman when she cheat is emotional so i don't want to be emotionally attached to anybody outside of my husband if i'm emotionally attached to somebody else then i'm cheating because that person is then facilitating an emotional need that my husband either has not done or is, is incapable of doing or i've become bored with what he, is, he has done or he is doing that i have to go outside uh-uh then that marriage or that relationship is doomed to failure. When anytime you have to step out of the bounds of you and that person, you are in, you're just heading down the wrong path and there's no coming back a lot of times. I've seen people cheated on each other and the trust, the level of trust is just gone. So I want to know that I can talk to my husband and say, you know, honey, I'm bored. You know, I don't like where we're we are. We are, um, do you have any suggestion? I was thinking about this. I was thinking of maybe we go away. I was thinking about we go to a party. I was thinking we go to a movie, go out and eat, just the two of us, get some babysitter for the kids. You know, there's various ways of us doing it. My husband and I live in two different countries. And it's the hardest thing that I've ever had to do. I never like leaving him. Sean is in Jamaica. I'm here in the U.S. And it kills me a lot of time. But I have to look at the end goal. I have to look at the fact that, you know, we have so many ways of communicating with each other and there's so many different things that we can do to, um, you know, nurture that relationship. But if he's doing one thing and not thinking about my feeling or I'm doing one thing and not thinking about his feeling, then, yeah, it's not, we're not on the same page and it's not going to go far. I oftentimes say then you transition into a business marriage. You know what I mean? Or we are roommates. Or we, you know what I mean? It's not a marriage. It's not a relationship. A relationship is not an easy thing. It's hard work. Just like, oh, you have to put the work in to fix the car and maintain the car and all this other stuff. It's the same thing. A lot of people forget that. It takes a lot of work because you're dealing with people. You're dealing with emotion. You're dealing with, with a different way of thinking. Men think differently from women. We don't, and we are all individual. We all, you know, so it's so much complication. But that's my little piece on it. All right. Well, welcome back. And of course, a lot of a mouthful there, and um, interesting views. Do not believe that Texter do, does not voice voice Fox Popper does not believe that you should be looking elsewhere. All right, Sorry listen. for any form of entertainment outside of your relationship. The moment you do that, yes. it's destined yes. for, for failure. No. Can't mm. agree. I mean, I agree with, 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 with some of the things. Mm -hmm. Right? Because... All right. I'm going to make it... I'm going um, um, to choose to trivialize the whole situation. Mm -hmm. Some habits where we have are not necessarily the best ones where your partner would I want. So think about a bridge where love play a domino. Think about a bridge where love hang out a bar. Mm -hmm. A film entertainment that I know with she, you know, involves sex. You know, you might hang out, uh, you might ha hang out at the domino place with a bridge in the mouth and talk all kind of stuff. Crap. You know, bridge and bridge and stuff. Mm -hmm. Crap. Right? Go ahead. With the other bar, you know. Drink some liquor, flirt with the bartender, she sit down there and lap on them something. Huh? <laughs> yeah. Stick a pin, brother. <laughs> no, man. No, no pin and even stick there, so I don't pin one stick. 
No, oh, I mean. she, I don't want to <laughs> clap him. I'm not. Go- Gracie, you said it's all a matter of time. I know, but I can't clap him. <laughs> I'll save it for next week. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Nah, I mean, remember, you know, the bartender working you know, is for try to hustle up the money after you, you know, and, and you go there for, 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 for drink away certain things. And, you know, that, nah, that's not nothing where. Oh. Your gum, your um, your really? wife, your wife, I go, I go pour your liquor, eh, and bubble pan you. Oh, she not gonna do that, eh? Hmm. I mean, what? what so why, if, why, if, why, if, why, if, if moms, if moms, yeah, no, yeah, you know, your no. presents are out of your presents. Yeah, no, yeah, no. Shit chats on the phone. Yeah, no, yeah. It doesn't that. matter, does it? Well, it I shouldn't matter. No, listen what I'm saying. Because said, you see? just go out all right, well and on. you work hard right, 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 well and you on. go to complete down with your friends let's, and you well come on. Let's back. Talk about, let's You're talk about boring. Fr- let's talk about from the woman's side. The things that women do to entertain themselves with somebody else. Let's let's be real. Me don't say something real with Domino. Me don't say something real real with the bar. You dress know? up and go out with your girls. Girls night out. Alright. So you you dress up and you're gone out with a girl then. Sexy as cock chicken. Yeah. Anything. Mm-hmm. Yeah, so you're not gonna do that. That? Yeah. Yeah, you're gonna do that. That's on that, the that, 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 lower that, level end of the no, phone. That, no, no, but that's a phone or thing, right? Yeah, Just, but you have things no, no, well, and well, you have things no, no, and listen, you have things. Different no, listen, tiers. When the girls them dress up different and extreme. go. Different extreme. When the girls them dress up and go, out, you're not gonna do those pretty much similar things where the guys them dress up and do. You're not gonna dance with, you're not gonna dance with guys, right? Or sometimes you're gonna dance amongst yourself, you know, guy buying a liquor. Right? One might exchange number, one might get it right number, or one might get the wrong number. Right? Things like these happen. The bridge might link you and you might shun him. Or you might choose to entertain in a, in a further conversation with, um, with the bridge. Right? Depending on what go on a yard with your relationship because women do deal with certain things because of, of um, as me always say, reprisal. You know what I mean? So, and like we as men, we just do a thing because we just do a thing. So ladies do have them habit. Ladies mm-hmm. do go to the hairdresser and laba laba and chat, chat them on a business. That's and, entertaining. And, well, of course. Oh, please. Of course people go there for no people business. Right? Ladies get up now and them... We say, boy, for example, they're going to meet with the girls, but really and truly, they're not necessarily meeting with the girls. <laughs> they just do that. So, we so could talk real. We could talk the other something we don't do. We could talk about what we don't do in general. Right? So, we have the other thing now where ladies will also do too. Ladies will come to so booms and go to a social club. Right? A social environment just for no argument sake what's happening so then can bring it back come a yard and say honey you know i think we should get so and so so uh, do you have a problem with, with her going to say a strip club a dance club where those men dance and carry on do you have a problem with that she and the girls just no, pack up and uh, they no go. Re- all right all right hold on as entertainment no, for her no remember no you talk about me as moms because remember no not, not moms this is well all right. yeah, moms in the case yeah no. but i'm saying no it, 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 what, right. what is your take with with her doing something like that it's not she so if if she ever get into that then i'm gonna start wonder why go on why should you <laughs> you, you you're coming what? from work <laughs> no, every on. day she tired no, of one no, well, something well i know you hear what i said a while ago yeah you're gonna walk on if no. she changes that attitude okay right so right away it's gonna be a red flag people evolve no no listen what i'm saying to you if me meet her, I know say boy she's a going out type of person. I me take her up knowing that. Right? It's a whole different ball game. Yes, but I'm saying people can evolve in relationships. Well on, listen what I'm saying. Where now she thinks she has been probably exposed to something or she has heard or read something. Mm. And she thinks, you know what? You know I what? I really want to experience this before All right, well I on. get older where I can't right. go anywhere. Alright, watch me now. No, listen now. Let me suggest this to well you. Well, well Anna, you, you you know you know what happened now? Uh-huh. Right? You go home. Start out first and foremost. Make sure, make sure the book work and the homework do. And make mm-hmm. sure make sure say boy the data are focused on certain things. Mm-hmm. Anything we're gonna change that's gonna be a problem. You, Hold on you, there. You get to message you? No, but she, you have so, week. Come on, you well. No, she man. has weekends. No, listen what I'm saying to you, no? She has vacation time. Right. And you're saying if but she chooses I'm to go to, you, to a strip club. What I'm saying to you. Is it going to become a problem? No, what I'm saying to you. You see, anything we're going to change that status quo. 
Because remember, you know, you say you want to experience this before you get older. Right? What's wrong with that? No, so I'm asking you. No, no. For the, for the, Status quo make it boring. No, for the type of... No? You see where my daughter concerned? It have to go boring, you know? <laughs> it have to go boring. Right? If I that you call boring. No, do not See? put more in it. So, Don't put no, more in no, it. No, more no, set aside, no. more guess what she's supposed to no, get. Remember, all no, the attention, no, etc. You, you say in a my situation. So we have to think about the factors them which is which are which are important. Yes, but See? I don't think so, you're being so, fair. So so, so, so me so me I go say to you say no, I have had situations now where me date girls where go out, them are outgoing, they will go them party, they will link up with their friend. Right, them alone and their friend come apart. The man will buy them liquor. Yeah, a totally different stuff that you ask me now. If you if you want to talk about them girl there, right? Where 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 the system knows say boy yo that you want go on with them girl there. No. See, me, me, well, I know, when I say them girl, I talk about yes. people where me did there with it. Yes. So you, you, you know say know. You, you you know say when you're in your bed asleep, <laughs> girl pick the girl in a club with their friend them. When me wake up a man that's stressed about. <laughs> you, you, you get to me and say, yeah, I so, get so, so it's, a, it's a totally different thing. I'm asking in the context where general, let us say you're with a woman, whether it's with mom you're referring to now or prior to. I am saying the scenario just presents itself really where you're with this female, and based on this prompt here, things are monotonous and the boredom is there. So despite you meeting a woman and the woman was never a going out type or whether she was mm -hmm. to an extent, now she wants to go to another level where she's feeling that I'm feeling bored. Yeah. I'm used to this particular way since we met, we're getting to get got together and this is just what it has been. Mm -hmm. Now I would like to experience something differently. Why okay. do you have to think negatively that her desire her desire for no, more but, but is I, negative? But, no, but a different something I asked me now. It's the same thing I was asking you, man. No man, a different something I asked So me I'm now. asking you if in that scenario mm. and based on this prompt, yeah. if it is that you would have a problem mm. if she decides that, look. You know, I've never ever gone to a club to watch those guys strip. Mm. The girls and I have no man. Go on, trip. man. Go on, man. You okay with it? Yeah, go on. We are going. We are going. Me gone. Me, me not go down. <laughs> you <laughs> see, you sad friend. No, <laughs> no. Go on. A different something. You tell me now. Listen, what, listen, listen what me I said to you, Zane. Huh. When you talk about a relationship and boredom. Right? It's a major thing that. Yes, it is. Zane? No. It's when you are bored. Suppose a man look at and say, boy, but me not bored. So you are say, you're bored, me boring. I'm going to say, but me I enjoy myself. Something wrong with you, you must be blind. Right? So it means, say, whether my chuku chuku <laughs> sweet to me. Right? But you know, yeah, to me right, as well. right. So <laughs> when me I tell you, say, well, my girl, me don't know what you're talking about. You know, me all right, you know. <laughs> no, that is where you have a bigger problem too. <laughs> me all right, you know. He sees nothing wrong with the fact that you're saying. No, me all right. Bored. And him all right. Me all right. Me, one selfish prick. <laughs> <laughs> me I got stress over you and your high demands for. Go long, but we'll come back to the chuku chuku. You see me? I'm a good. Thing. Right? <laughs> hey, I'm going to show you something. I'm going to You see, this entertain business, some women have to understand and some virgin have to understand too. <laughs> you see, this part here, yeah, when, 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 when um, people say, boy, things change and they're going to spice up the relationship. Mm -hmm. And you come home now and you're going to do something new. Boy, we will learn that from and people fret about that. Mm. I'm going to show you something, Cassidy. More all of the youth them listen to this. Take that the road advice, but I want you. Oh Lord. See? You see, because you don't know say the, say the woman, I even the woman them too. I gonna know say, I, I, I go, it's gonna now become an allegation. Say That's as something you, you're gonna learn out of the road. Cassidy, all you have to do. Let it be known and, and deliberate, deliberately set it up to get caught quite a bit of time watching porn. Right? You see, you do that. Every action where you do, how the pool you learned from. You hear that, ladies? They're liars. <laughs> Them see, liars. You have enough to do the thing, Cassidy. 
So, she can't say a road you're gonna do it. Moms, me see this the blues, you know, so I want to try it out. Then tell you, you're perfect. The and ladies, already, do the same know. thing with him. Watch them and see what they do <laughs> and try it. Yes. Quit it. <laughs> clear. You have, you have the original, not clear. You keep on, you keep, you copyright no, something. No, but you know. want the ladies, them to understand, say, they must just watch the thing too and come back and do the same thing too and just say, you see? like him say, yo, star, what going on last night, my girl? And what you do? Will you learn that? Yes, man, I you know, stop watch some things to catch some new moves just yeah. for you. Yes. And it's not Gary out there showing me nothing. No, you're not for calling. You see, you're giving yourself already. You I'm, give, I'm you're saying that, I'm much putting already. I'm that for you, you know, about <laughs> Gary from that. Right? So, one, uh, 347 says, relationship outside of your main relationships have to contain respect and boundaries. It can be healthy. If the conversations and entertainment is appropriate. True. And that and this goes back to boundaries. Once boundaries are crossed, it can be a positive. It can once boundaries aren't crossed, it can be a positive relationship. Sometimes some people set the rules and then they end up breaking them. And sometimes that becomes a problem. So man meets girl, boy meets girl, and he knows that boy, girl is married or girl has somebody. The person might not be around, might, might, might not be in the island, or, or might be there. And he decides that, you know, I want to engage into something with you. I am fond of you. I like you. And I'm really attracted to you. And both adults decide, because that's really their choice, they decide to get together. And then, after a while, either him or she decides to them want more than just this because right now, me I catch feelings. Me I catch feelings for you. And me, me can't with the I don't seek thing no more. And they, you know, me I feel I see you sometime no more. Me can't manage it. Me want more. Right. So you find that that sometimes, but, definitely. All right, but let me ask a question. Is it that some of the time where... You see, all of them something that just be a be a problem, you know, because some of the time when people say them are catch feelings for the person, what they mean by that? <laughs> it no longer does um, um surface. It's gone deeper now. The the the, uh, the emotions getting stronger. The ties get stronger. The knot can hardly pull. Yeah, but where you like about me now? Where you know about me? They get they just keep on giving me more and more and the best of you so which is what it's, yeah man more man more uh, <laughs> more so was, <laughs> no you have some persons who when they started out probably even say even with, with sexual encounter it was just for the sake of the fact that men and women are attracted to each other they yeah, go but, there but, that, but said, over that's time all, but that's all you know about me over time, right. but that, that clouds that, a lot of people's vision, you know, and just all, you know. all you know about me, I'm a chuku chuku. You don't know nothing else about me, <laughs> right? And then you, you, you fall, fe, is it me or the chuku chuku? Infatuation um, is the destroyer many times because True. we don't stop to think deeper. Do I really, really, really want this person? Do I really feel that I, I love this person genuinely hey, despite everything? Let me tell you something. And it's not always the case of a yes. You see, I feel my bridge, you know. We're, we're, up, we're up, so. Because in all these people, so I chat him. <laughs> see? His sister never want a man to come to yard. You know what I mean? That are all. So, so everything did hype and nice and sweet. But now, my bridge is going to live nowhere. Maybe him now catch a certain level of, as I said, just insecurity. Now, for she, there's no security in that insecurity because look like now my bridge would have more for want to load up the thing when she prefer to hide. So sometimes, you know, wife will not worry about herself because so, 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 so mate out there, they even two to her up front, you know. <laughs> so mate no one up front. So mate no one who no man. I tell you, no. Just want to have fun. So, how comfortable would any woman or any man be? Mm. Is it because of intercourse? Is that really the problem? Right? 
Remember, say the something saying that what are some of the other things them where you think outside of sex that way that constitute as cheating? Right? Phone sex. They're not having sex. Phone You're on sex. The phone talking. So phone sex is cheating. Isn't it? No would see it as that. Is what? Uh, no. Man on phone, girl on phone, talking and telling each other what it is that they would want to do to each other. And what they are planning to do to each other when they buck up. Buck up in her. Yeah. yeah? And you're telling me that ain't cheating? And you, you ain't talking to me in the bed in the nights like that? No, but you're not upon the phone. No. When you come, when you come for the phone, when we come home, and you're, you're, not, you're not talking to your friend no, no more. No, no, And we no. come home, we're in bed together. Yeah, but there's yeah? nothing. There's you, no... you don't whisper those things in my ears. No. But here you are on the phone with this yes. chick. Yes. Yo, baby, me I tell you, you know, star. Anytime you know, I buck you. I buck you and I tell you, you know. Yes, right. You got to reach cloud 20, you know. Yeah. And all these things. No, but hold on. Remember, you know, re re you have to remember something. Come on, man. That's cheating. No. It's cheating. No. Hold on, my you girl. cheater. It can't be cheating. What is it? Answer. Okay, answer. I cheat you, I cheat no. my youth. You're having sex in the not... mind. Sex in the Hello. mind. Hello, caller. Good night. Welcome to the show. Thanks for calling. Good night. Good night. This sounds like chummy, chummy. Creo, that are not cheat. Awa. No, sir. That are sweet. I'm happy to be with intercourse. I'm good for one way you can't cheat. No, that mama. Cheat. No, Chami. I know one way you can cheat. No, sir. Oh, you are going to cheat. Oh, you are going to cheat. You know, I so you're cheating. Somebody that's not cheating. But, 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 Chami. You know, so the Bible, very Bible tell me about looking at another man's wife. That's lusting. That's and a it's lot. a sin. Yes, but that's still not cheating. Yes, man, you're cheating, man. No, no, man no. Man, pass phone with you and talk to you. A man a on lot. the phone. So, so tell me something now, Charmy. If you're a gentleman, mm. dip on the phone with a sister, mm. and they might talk certain things, and you like, might like whisper, you can't leave him here, you must say. Are you even coming? Come catch him on the phone. I tell her mm. what and what him I go do. Well, you never even do to you or tell you before. You not call her cheating. You don't get no, mad and dark and hungry upon him. He my plan too. He not cheat yet. He's planning to cheat. Oh, yes, but he not cheat. No, when sir. he cheat or when he actually do the act, that's when the cheating is. So happening. you can't cheat in your mind then? That's what you're saying? Yes, he might premeditate it. He not cheat. Oh. He cheat. When it when it happen, he cheat. <laughs> he premeditate it. <laughs> well, Jamie, if he can't think mm -hmm. about it, believe you me, it will go happen. If you can't talk about well, it, well, me not. I don't it say no, out. but I'm saying it. it you can't <laughs> say cheat until he actually committed the act. All right, he, ha, he have a premeditating in mind. So when uh, when he commit the act, no, that is the time when he cheat. Okay, darling. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Big up, charm. Big Look up yourself every time, charm. Nice to hear yeah. you, darling. Nice to hear you. <laughs> Long time not hear charm at all. So, me think I cheated, you know, me not lie. Me not give you charm tonight at all, at all, at all. No, listen, mm -hmm. listen. Um, Before we go, Bonnie in Port Moran says, I don't like it, none at all. My partner being entertained by someone else, especially a male, no, sir. Question, how about your partner not sleeping with you and both of you live in the same house? And that, not, that not some, something, listen, again, man, problem, I go on, listen, man, something wrong. Something is wrong. Another caller on the nine five four. Good night, caller, and welcome to the show. Cleo, how you doing? Hi, Dan. Dan, where have you been? Been a guy nowhere. Oh, how was your, how was your vacation? <laughs> <laughs> What's your take tonight, Dan? Dan, look here. It's a chance. I go. I know how you how you come by, by that cheating thing. There, no? look. If you are planning, if you in your mind, you, do, you go go one night and, and, and I think about how oh, you're going to rob NCB Bank. All right? Just a thought. <laughs> you're not doing it, you know. Where, where you go, where you go do? You're going to honest you. I, I, I are you gonna turn yourself, rob the bank. Wait, wait. <laughs> the honest, honest clear. Are, are you going to turn yourself in the morning to the police and, and say, you know, I'm not planning to rob the bank. Nobody who robs <laughs> the bank or plans to rob the bank will tell the police. So that's needless to say. Are, are you going to so do even that? If, 
No, but even if I had, the point is I wouldn't call the police and tell them that. So I don't I don't understand the question. Right. So so you're planning you're planning to, 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 to get back at N C B because them 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 take you you can't run on to to blow a thousand and them and and then take your money. Why? You you call it do you call it robbery? Technically, mentally, yes. <laughs> 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 Dan Dan, you, you want hold or you want to link with back after the break? <laughs> eh? You want to link with back after the break? Yeah, man, yeah, man. All right. All right, Dan. It's now 11.30, ladies and gentlemen. The time is brought to us by VJ Printing Services. And Real Talk is sponsored by Native Audio Stage and Lighting. Architects, draftsmen, and surveyors, get your drawings printed in high-quality professional standards. We can satisfy your printing needs. Whether it is for presentation to your clients or for submitting building and subdivision application, make it VJ Printing Services. Whether drawing by hand or with computer-aided softwares, we will plot your negatives and print the copies as you need. We do high-quality white paper printing that is water-resistant and never fades, unlike traditional blueprint. For more information, call VJ Printing at 893-2266 No space The body where you are Push it on me You don't know this is Craig T Now we're representing for the Adrenaline Rush With the musical ingenious Digital T Saturdays right here on Styles FM You don't know 48 to make the date And don't be late You understand Because the new arts and new music segment Is from 5 to 6 So make sure you're there And the girls there Until them are born up the place It's not left no space Don't miss it Planning a party? Club night out? Stage show, a gospel concert, or even a business sales event? Let Styles FM be a part of your promoting tool. Take advantage of our low price promotion packages with commercials, interviews, giveaways, reviews, and much more. We have special offers when you mix and match and bundle your options. Contact us at 876 286 9216 or 439 5160. Styles FM for the most effective way to exploit your marketing dollar. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, now offering stage, lighting, and trust systems for your small and medium-sized events. Whether it's a stage show, concert, drama play, wedding, street party, or club setting, you name it, we'll bring it to life. Call us at 871-5212 or 844-6531. Native Audio Stage and Lighting, a sponsor of In the Know of the Law with Sergeant Del Rose Green and also Real Talk with Lady Cleo and Daddy Rude. Welcome back to the show we're gonna go to some more of the vox pop right about now all right so i believe relationships can get boring um but if you're in it for the long run like you kind of have to find ways to eliminate it from getting boring but if you're just in it for a minute where you know like okay if it gets boring that's your cue just to be out then that's fine on the person but if you're in it for the long run and you expect to spend years or your life with this person you have to know that not every day is going to be oh ups and funny there are going to be days that you're not going to speak or there are going to be days that you're going to be in your own mood but you know at the end of the day like that's the person that you want or you know that you know today we're just in a mood but tomorrow or we're going to fix it or we're going to make it work but if you realize that you're unable to change the mood with somebody like they're always so okay it's just always bored but you're like an upbeat um person then probably that's not a person for you i also believe that you know persons can cheat um and it doesn't have to be sexually with someone else for example you are probably dating a guy and he's not as emotional or not as open as you'd like him to be but then you have a friend who's a guy but he's more understanding he's more in tune with his emotional self so you're more drawn or attached to him in having those intimate conversations to you it may not seem like anything but you're depriving your spouse of that part of you even though they're not capable of it instead of just shutting them out and say you know what he doesn't have a sensitive side let me talk to I don't know John because John is more in tune to sensitive side you are cheating emotionally and it goes the same way for girls you'll have guys who are closer to a female because um, you know she gets them more they have a, a relationship when it comes to sports or something or even cars 
you are cheating on your significant other because you're depriving them of getting that side of you. All right, so think about it. We go in a relationship and we expect our significant other to give us their 100% um, undivided attention or self and they expect the same from us. But if 20% of them is having, you know, deep conversations or 20% of them is talking about sports or anything of the sort, but they're giving that 20% to somebody else, then you're only getting 80% of them. So that's not being in a full relationship. You're actually sharing them or sharing a part of them with somebody else. So what would you do now if, okay, your, you and your boyfriend cannot talk about sports because it's not your interest or you don't know anything about it. Is it okay for him to have a girl who's all about sports for them to converse, for them to go to the games about it? Yes and no. Yes, if you know the person or you know the girl and you know that the relationship is strictly going to be friendly and then no because persons can actually bond over small things like that and end up starting a relationship and you are left out in the cold. What you can do and this will also, you know, eliminate the relationship from being boring, even though you don't know the sport, but even just you know, putting out the effort to ask questions about the game or go with your significant other to the game or in the regards to a boy, you know, if your girlfriend wants to have like these deep conversations, you're probably not as in tune. At least listen, say something every now and then or, you know, try to find something that you guys can relate on to pretty much fill the gap of the intimate relationship so you can then get the full 100% of her versus somebody else. You know, you know where else from people cheating and besides sexing? The only way that someone can cheat is making love. Because even if a person lied to you, that's not cheating. Cheating is just by making love. So for me, for someone to cheat, they definitely have to sleep with someone else. Well, if me not a relationship on a board, you know, me have to find some ways and means to make spice in it. Because from the moment your relationship getting boring, people drifting. Anytime the relationship become boring, somebody else out there occupy the time. When no spice now in your relationship and it become bored, that means somebody else will get their life get get the real thing of the relationship because anytime you have somebody there and the relationship on fire you're not going to have a dull moment in there but from the moment it get boring somebody else in between it i can tell you that real talk you have to entertain your relationship in order to keep it from boring and for me i would not recommend whether sexually or not sexually for somebody that cannot be healthy for my relationship to have somebody entertaining my partner whether it is sexually or not sexually that could never be healthy for me and that for me is a no no none at all i will not accept that at all <laughs> Look here, as Sham said, when your relationship boring, you go find ways and means to, to do spice whatever, it spice it up. And I'm telling that the root of spice it up, and I say yes, Natural. naturally or artificial <laughs> seasoning. All right. <laughs> well, um, r- regarding Coach Mark, yes, the answer I go be no because it uh, not, just like what Sham said, if it not happen, eh? No, listen. Oh, the money comes up. Oh, you come to my yard. No. Oh, you mean if you catch man's money for not tell the man what she gonna do with the man? I yeah. what she want the man for the to her. Yeah. You're telling me that she ain't cheating? No. And you would not feel anyway. Of course, I'm gonna feel that way. She not cheat. <laughs> we are feel we for she not cheat. No, you're gonna feel that way, sir boy. Feel that way for what? Well, well, there's a there's a, there's a there's a plan to plan, but if no, you no, no 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 don't don't take my words now, brother. Well, if the Do plan not fall take up, my well, words well, now. If the plan fall up, then you can't go charge the person. Look for, here, uh, for a crime when I commit. Look here. Well, Anna, you, you if, confused. If, you just say if you want she a plan to. You, and no, but you can't argument, charge her for the crime. You have, you, you, have, you have to find a different crime for charge her too. Were you vexed for then? You can't charge her because she has no, been cheated. No, no, Don't no. be upset. No, She's well, just I'm having not. entertainment from a friend. 
they're just having an entertaining no. conversation. Yes, yes, they are. But here, here's the reason why the upset come in now, Zane. You know, if you upset my if you No, man, remember, you know, if you, you know, say you're supposed to, in the thing and, 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 and the relationship is supposed to set away where and say, you know, expect that from her, the no, expectation. No, no, no. no expectation. So, so, no, no, be so, 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 the disappointment I go cause you to be upset. No, the upset. You Are it? you boring? But well, let me ask is you a question. Is you boring? Let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question, right? Uh, Big man thing. Answer me no, you want ask me one. No, but me answer you already. Answer one man. Right? You feel, say, if, 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 if a man go to a prostitute that's cheating, Without my permission, yes. Uh, no, that's, yes, that, that's all right. Yes. A man got to a process. If me oh, you know, discuss oh, it oh. and say, this is what we want to try out and blah, blah, blah. If that was not established and you go behind me, I can go out there. Yes, you cheat. You PR and you cheat. Pardon. No, man. <laughs> Let's see what my godmother is saying. Miss Winsom in St. Thomas. Peace and love, God. Your sister, help me, Godmother, my <laughs> God daughter and daddy road. I just listening your show and it is very interesting. Your show make me learn more. Pick up yourself, Mama. Win some, Mama. Win some, man. Yes, man. That was wrong. No matter what, we not fi answer one another phone. <laughs> <laughs> As I said, do you get calls on this phone? <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Miss Winsome. Good to hear from you. Vivian says, good evening, Lady C. How are oh, oh Lady C? How are you? Daddy Rule. Look like he's on the war path with the six pack thing. <laughs> <laughs> Vivian, good to see you locked in. You are, I haven't seen in a while, but good to see you coming through tonight. Uh, let's see what Coach Mark says. Yes, you can ch Chai, charge girl, her with, the, with crime. the crime. It's called conspiracy. <laughs> if you plan to kill someone, you go to jail for that. Uh, thank you very much, Coachy. Um, Tigo says, Lady Cleo, that's flirting, not cheating. Tigo. <laughs> me, I could just divorce you good, good in a Tigo because <laughs> you, you know, get the thing in a Tigo. It is cheating. It is cheating, Tigo. Why are not cheating if the men them do it, but if the women do it, they, they feel, we are not vex for. You know, for vex. Pick up yourself, yeah, fair Melissa enough. from Peer Tree River. Good night, my Styles family. St uh, Friday night, husband and wife. <laughs> 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 Minister, come catch a little real talk. Pick up yourself, always Madly. locked in. Yeah, man, real avid listener. Uh, so, mm -hmm. entertainment will come um, based on how bored people are, and they'll find ways yes, and means yes, of yes, entertaining yes. themselves. Yes. Now, most of the ways that they find outside of sex is considered cheating. Uh, let me ask you a question. Got the thought process behind it? No, what will on? Your, 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 your partner have an ex and, and, and they always, always a run joke about what they used to do, but they not do it no more. You remember when we used to so and so? You're really gone, you're really gone on the word with, 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 with ex? Eh? You remember when we used to so and so? Conspiracy hey, again. You, hey, boy, my girl, I tell you the truth, them something now go on for me again, you know? Oh my boy. goodness gracious <laughs> me, oh my. You want there to be pandemonium? Continue on that road. Yo! And of course, the other part to the box pop. Um, let's go to Coach Mark's comment first. All the guys that are saying it's not cheating are going to be the first to ball. <laughs> Maybe it you're right. To them. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Maybe Yet it's yes. It's not cheating, right, Coach? Maybe I yes. I tell you. No. R r r r remember, you know, I must say, yes, we are going to hurt. For why? I Be did declare why? that um, we're going to feel hurt. I'm going to feel hurt. You're not supposed to feel hurt. You're, yeah. you're, you're mixing me up. You're confusing me here. No. Because <laughs> if it's not cheating, you should all say, oh, sure. no. she ain't doing nothing. She's just talking to her friend. That's fine. No, remember. That's cool. Know, remember, Tigo said it's flirting. Coach Mark says conspiracy to do it. You conspire. So you're, you're going to hurt because of Yo, the act. And that's what I'm saying. You it never is, hurt. It, it, you shouldn't hurt because you say it's not cheating. The woman not cheat on you. The woman only talking. She's just being entertained. But let me, but, but you She's see, just being entertained. But, but you know, say, my view and your view relating, relating to this prostitute thing is different. And I can't see it as being cheating. Oh, 
You're not cheating. You have your good up, good up woman in your yard. Mm -hmm. We're nothing wrong with her. Right? And you just decide, say, all right, I'm going to leave mom's at home tonight. And go to the distillery. And go... <laughs> 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 and don't get me wrong when I say good up, good up. I mean, you're not that she's better than the one who does that for a living. Mm -hmm. I'm simply saying she's at home, everything good, jiggy, you know, no, all right. And she, you leave her at home or wherever and decides to go I'm up there and go buy something. Why, go you buy need, something. why you need to go buy it? Why? Fear dance dead? No, hold on. You have to remember something on my girl. You want what? Entertainment. That's cheating. No, hold on, man. It's cheating. No, but am I money? No, the, which should be mine. So you're it you're giving up money. money. And my money, and you're I'm, cheating. I'm gonna spend money. There's a commodity out there eh? when I want. Ah. And I like I'm emotionally at, um, attached to this person. There's no emotions in it. Having a toy she, is she that not, cheating? She no emotion. Eh? No. Not cheating. No. You sure. Yes. Oh, it, oh, it, oh, it's gonna be cheating. You talk when a woman have them tie and them yeah. do what them do. I don't see it as that. So she's even. They're working and working and you, with it. Mm. And it's okay. Uh, it's not cheating. Never say it's, it's okay. What wrong with it if you're not cheating? <laughs> this money, what is wrong are, with the toy no. if it's not cheating? Well, are, remember, you know, we're talking about, talk about, uh, talk about the things them outside of, of, of um, oh, oh, it's the second part, no? Uh, look. Apart, apart from intercourse. Yeah, there are there, there's 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 any intercourse other. There. She's having an affair with her dildo. Yeah. And she's not really, really interested in you because she gets so accustomed to the the, 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 the craftiness of the dildo that y you come in like a joke. Yeah. She's not cheating on you? No, dildo? no, no, she's not. <laughs> she's not. You feel bad though. Yeah. She's not gain on. Yeah, because. But you no know, feel now, you're just saying, no, my girl, go on easy say, I'm tired, man. I'm tired. So no, on, well, listen now, listen now. If, if, remember now, if the man are right and the man get feeling like a chuku chuku. Everything is everything. She gonna do whatever she want to do. You know, when him done chuku chuku and she not satisfied and she go to the deal though. I just saw the thing set. Oh really? Right. Yeah. I had a sister. Well, she I'm still my sister, but pretty much that's what happened when the virgin gone. She just go do what she had do. I just saw the, I just saw it go. Mm -hmm. You know. But if you're there and she's doing it, she cheating? No, but no, no, no. For that happen in a people relationship, the, the, the bridge you know, so she do that and yeah, but in, I, I, I just part of what they do. Get no, none him the right to live in the same no, house. There is no, there's no man on earth where go there with a woman and do that and then nah get none out of it. <laughs> no, there are some captivity business yeah. that you talk about, my Aye. girl. Hear this part. Uh, if you were bored in a relationship, <laughs> what exactly would you do? Hmm. Well, I would do what Daddy Rose says is not cheating. Which is what? Get, get a dildo. Get a dildo. That's it. Mm -hmm. Fair enough. Um, <laughs> f f uh, for me, if I'm bored, mm -hmm. I need to go get myself some entertainment. <laughs> <laughs> I need to go get myself some and if, entertainment. And if a catty calls you up and on the phone, video call and showing you I don't do video calls. I don't do video calls. Okay, so I hear you. No, I don't do video. No. Listen. And you take out the phone and look at the pictures and say, oh God, I can turn the phone so. Yes, you yes, like yes. Sit ball. No, but. You go upside down. Right, so. but, but that, that's, that's the thing about it right now. Them something is like some boy, my old thing drop. Me now get them things that's so right now. Me need some entertainment in my life. You know what I mean? But, you see, for me, <coughs> you'd have to go find out what caused the boredom. Yes. Because some of the time, you know, and we, we, we think we overrate ourselves too much when we say, boy, we, we are going to do something. How long that can last for? How long that the fire that I go, I go, I go burn for? So you're you, 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 you going to reignite the mm -hmm. flame. Mm -hmm. No, for the time, you know, my girl, we got movies and we see something happening at the movies, right? The movie have a happy ending. Mm -hmm. But beyond the, end, beyond the ending, we don't know what's going beyond the ending. Because in real life, life still continues. So while things rekindle and a burn and a go on and a blaze, how long them are going to change up this and change up that? If you know, say, well, all right, you know, say, Everything still good. There is no way. Well, well me not see it. I, I just don't see it. When you're in a, when, when you're in a relationship, 
yeah, 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 you have the um the, the, the thing they curve. What them call it? Lord have mercy. In a maths class. Whatever the the the, the, the S curve. Mm-hmm. Right? So the more things change, right, the the more the variables change. You you will start at one point but it also peak Fl- out. Fluctuates and Right? Okay. When it peak, what you gonna do when it peak? Yeah, you have to put in more a uh, something and start a different Yes. Pattern. A different um, a, a, a different adding something else right now. And and then it peak out again. So you have a thing when you have continuous improvement. Mm-hmm. Lemon cycle of continuous improvement. Plan, do, check, act. Right? So if you're fine, say after and and, and the real thing it happens. No, for the time, you know, Cassie, the same people when they put on phone and talk about some boy, when they catch you later, what may I go do? When they catch you later, they do what they have to do, you know. After a while, that, when they catch you later, what may I go do, get boring and mon- um, monotonous. Mm-hmm. What else you I go do? <laughs> <laughs> Not tell me, just show me. Right? So, these are the things where, in my view, we have to just enjoy life as it comes. Right? Because you're feeling we're not bridges and sisters. You see, all of them something the way you see people say they might entertain themselves. Them have to find new means of entertaining after a while. It's like when you buy yourself on a video game. When the game, when you play the game and you, and you go through all the levels, in a full term in Jamaica, when, when, when you buck the game, <laughs> it's a new game you want. Mm-hmm. Right? It's a new game you want. So, and yeah, sometimes you, you, you get a song game back in the days. Me, 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 me is an Atari and Nintendo smaddy. Really? Right? Me don't know nothing about, and, and, and back in the days, Sega Genesis. Me don't know nothing about no, no sitting where I go on, no, whatever I want, them, PlayStation and all them sitting there. Back in the days, when, 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 when you get all one boring game, your Bex, <laughs> instantly you want a new game. New game. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So if the relationship boring, we don't have no time, Cassidy. We're going to rewrite no program. We'll look at new game. <laughs> right? Sometimes, you know, Cassidy, you never know bother for complaining, you know. Say so thing boring, you know. You just go and find a different way of entertaining yourself. Cheating. No, but no, no Cheating. Man. No, my girl. Nobody get into that. It's no, boring man. and you know, penetrate the boredom and you can find another way of entertaining yourself. Pretty much, it is going to be cheating. We'll just go buy a new game. Mm-mm. That not really so. I gotta be the case. No man. Let's so, so, see what Tiga saying. If the woman use a dildo, that's cheating. No, he's saying that's cheating. He's... Really? Really now? Okay then. I win some said that's cheating. Anyway, I take it. Stick to the evil. You know. Okay. Um, Coach, we yeah, read that one already. Yeah. All right, we're gonna hear the other vox pop quickly. How long is it, Cassidy? Can we go with it? Yes, so let's take out of Vox Pop. Indeed, people do place restriction on their relationships and make it um, boring. But at the same time, you have to be careful how open you are to, to other things because that too can actually create problems for your relationship. You understand? So, yes, there has to be res- restrictions because humans are humans and you give them a yard and then take some whole leap of miles, you know, tips. They go if you give them too much. So there has to be restrictions, but not the boring, not to the point where you're actually bored or there's there's no longer any fun. No, I don't believe in allowing any partner of mine to be entertained by someone else. Sexually or not, cannot be healthy for any relationship. If you need entertainment, then we are two adults, and I'm gonna think that we are mature enough where you can come to me and say, Hey, um, let's try this, let's try that, or whatever. Once you're going outside of a relationship to seek entertainment, then definitely I think it's time for you to walk away. If it is that you are spoken to your partner over and over and they're not willing to to entertain you then and you think that it's time to go find entertainment by somebody just leave you know makes no sense you hold on unless your person your, your partner crippler they are not functioning you know they have dysfunction it's in and restrictions in certain way and cannot entertain you certain ways so therefore you're probably and you're 
really, really in the relationship because, you know, you have them have been through a lot and you feel like to abandon them would create some sort of problem. Unless there's something else to it. But otherwise from that, no, it's best for you to leave. Yes, there are a lot of possible ways to treat to cheat. And we have to look at the word cheat carefully. Because if you are spending your time with somebody else, then you are cheating me, your partner of your time and time is one of the most valuable thing you understand what i say if you find it necessary to you're going through something and you find it necessary to find somebody else to talk to then you are cheating me of the opportunity for us to share you know what's happening between us whether whether it's something bad or good whether it's dreams or aspirations or whether or not it's it's a setback or something you are cheating me of the opportunity to be there for you and be your rock um or, or be your 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 go-to if you cheat me off that then that's cheating there's so many different ways persons can cheat trust me you know your phone time or how or, or much or you're there on the f- or, or, or long you're on the phone or, or often you're on the phone with somebody if you go hang out with that person um so many ways they can cheat you can kiss a person and cheat they don't have to actually be the actual intercourse people think that if they go and do um oral sex with somebody then oh it's not cheating so people think some things are not it you know for me once you start to conceptualize another person in your mind and you start to think of all the things that you can do and will do to them and you start spending time with them hanging out with them giving them gifts worse if you give them gifts and other things then you have money then you're cheating me of that whether not a fear money on your work feet spend it for me and make me entertain you if you understand what i mean and um if i'm born in a relationship I'm going to talk to my partner, right? And I am going to try and see how we can actually decrease and eliminate the boredom. You see, if it's mad ethic and them skull hard and then not trying and then not up to trying and then not down for it and them now whatever, then trust me, me a split, me a cut, me a left me gone. Now I'm around because life too short to spend it doing certain things. You must enjoy life because, you know, we don't must wake up tomorrow and I guarantee it to nobody. I'll try. If it not work, me not hold on. I was making this scenario with somebody the other day. Remember I'm small and them tie a tie a tie line around tree with a wire or rope or whatever and the tree grow over the wire and suck it in till you can't see it no more. Sometimes we hang on to some things that's not healthy for us and it damage we so no. Oh boy, real talk indeed. Um and of course, you know, we're coming up to the end of the show tonight. But just before we do um do that wrapping up session in a few, um cheat. Def- defined as act dishonestly, dishonestly. They upon the phone and make love upon the phone, and your partner, and your partner, if you, if you do that with acting dishonestly or unfairly in order to gain an advantage. It also refers to avoid undesirable by luck or skill. She cheated death in a spectacular crash. Avoid synonyms are avoid, escape, evade, elude, dodge, duck, miss, sidestep, bypass, skirt, shun. And all of those are words that are mean, mean the same thing. If it is that you're not doing something that you should be doing with your spouse, then clearly, if you're avoiding your spouse because you're bored, you're finding an escape. And you never want him to hear what you are talking when you are talking on the phone. You are talking you're talking about cheating. Cheating. <laughs> cheating. Exactly, it's cheating. Because okay. you're doing something that you're not supposed to be doing. You're acting dishonestly. Why, well, that, 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 that terminology where, where, where I bring it to is it, it too, <laughs> it, it too much. That means every minute me cheat. <laughs> I'm a cheater. Oh, yes, seven minutes. <laughs> I'm a cheater. <laughs> well, people, for me, in wrapping up, you know, the, the, the whole aspect of um, um, having someone else where I can make you comfortable apart from your partner, you know, is, is, is something we have to look into whether or not your partner, because your partner could be the problem, not necessarily you. True. Right? And instead of stress yourself and say you're going to hide and do something else for the sake of the relationship, 
that is where me think the whole deceit come in because if 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 you not happy more than likely your partner isn't as well. So mm-hmm. you have got to find a way now how to either break it off like what Shelly said, or you got to fix it. You know, a way where both pe- persons are happy. In a minute sense, you know something where you happy, the person happy, or the person is happy and you are unhappy. If if you got to find other means for entertain yourself, me think say. It would be good if the person is aware <laughs> of it, yep. you know, and kind of give consent. Consent. Then they must agree, but they can't get consent. For example, you know, at least when Daddy would watch two porn, he come back bad, <laughs> yeah, yeah. bad, uh, bad, bad, when bad. When you got cheat with the porn star, he come back bad. No, 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 uh, no, no, no. Um, right. <laughs> Gary from White House says, and if you are involved with three persons, who are you cheating on? You are cheating on who did it the first. And for the second one, the third one, are cheating on who did it the first and second. Everybody has a. <laughs> Nobody can too comfortable here, brother. Oh, boy, I tell you. Well, of course, matters of the heart will always make you view things differently and respond to some things way differently. While if it weren't a case of emotional involvement, certain things that we consider a problem would definitely not be a problem. But mm-hmm. humanly speaking, we understand how the human nature and how the mind works and how the emotions are bottled up in all of that. All right, but of course, we've come to the end of the show, guys. And it was a pleasure working with you. It was a pleasure being back uh, with my co-host, um, UL Jackson slash hmm. Daddy Rude, one in the same, <laughs> can I tell you? Oh, we see the different persons coming out sometimes, can I tell you, boy? And of course, our engineer tonight is Cassidy. Yep. So on behalf of our engineer and my co-host, Lady Cleo telling you to be good.